Isaiah 58 and 1, cry aloud, spare not, lift up thy voice like a trumpet, and shew my people their transgression, and the house of Jacob their sins. That's right, man. It says the house of Jacob. Who's that? So-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, man. Our job, okay, is to show you your transgressions so you can get right. So you can get right back with the Heavenly Father, okay? However, the elect is gonna get turn back to the heavenly father. Okay? Yeah, it says, um that was the point. Yeah, that was the point. Numbers Numbers 35 verse 33. So you shall not pollute the land wherein ye dwell. So, so you shall not pollute the land wherein ye are, for blood it defiles the land, and the land cannot be cleansed of the blood that is shed therein, but by the blood of him that shed it. Mm -hmm. That's right. So right now we're in Canada. Canada likes to uh, yeah. act like they're all innocent, man. Mm -hmm. Native Edomites, the so-called white people that live here. You like to act like you've done no wrong, like you haven't committed um, um, treachery, man. Murders, genocide. Robbery, genocide. Okay? Because even, even here in Canada right, and uh, in, in America, there's a lot of indigenous indigenous natives mm -hmm. right and they're very dark right it was just because of uh these so-called white man that came and he uh he basically like popped to that woman that popped our woman right and that uh, like, they killed our men right so there's a lot of tears you know in the, in, our, in, in the land right? sure. here in canada in america So the farm not there for the land which he shall inhabit wherein I dwell, for I the Lord dwell among the children of Israel. So the thing is, right? Right now when the scale is imbalanced right now, the judgment hasn't come for you, Edomites. Okay? The Lord is gonna bring that judgment with this upcoming World War III, man, and the nuclear missiles. That's how the land that's how the land is gonna be cleansed. Alright? All the pollution, okay? You people are talking about um global warming and pollution and all these things man well we need world war three that's right all right we need the missiles to come mm -hmm. we need the hand of the heavenly father to come down and judge you people, man in order for for this the earth to be righteous again man. Mm -hmm. okay you environmentalists you, you people that are all into saving the earth all right you should be down with our cause man we're about saving the earth you have our shimmy out shine right uh, Nahum three and one Go to the bloody city, it is all for the lies and robbery, the prey depart of not, the noise of a whip, and the noise of a rabbit. From the moment you were born, man, they've been feeding you lies, man. That's right. Okay? From from uh, your elementary schools, your high schools, all forms of education, man. It's lies. You know? I'm um, pretty much teaching you to assimilate to, to the society, the ways of this world. Right? Because you people really don't know the Heavenly Father, man. You don't fear Him. You have, you have uh, one. Stop. 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 You know, you, you only know that quote unquote God through your church, and they got it wrong, man. You know, they've been given a doctrine and a script to build uh, to the people, man. So you people think that the Most High only is good, right? How is it that? The most high is, is good, but yet you have people that he created committed evil, man. You see what I'm saying? You, you people like to uh, deify the most high as this one 
on emotion, man. Yeah, he created you to have many emotions. You don't think the Most High has emotions? The Most High laughs. The Most High um, wants justice. The Most High wants um, bring justice. He's jealous. He's jealous. All right, just like you, man, and you woman, get jealous, right? But oh no, not the Most High though. Right? That's fucked up. No, yeah, but you program two men that you can't you can't be jealous. Right. Oh, you're weak. You're weak. Oh, you're jealous. They start gaslighting you. You're, you're jealous because I wear this sexy dress. Right. You're jealous because my boots are showing. Mm -hmm. Right. You're insecure. Yeah, you're insecure. That's wickedness, man. And that's being perpetuated in society, man. Having you have self doubt, man. No, man. Exactly. No man's supposed to feel that way, man. That's right. What you people are doing is wickedness. Exactly. Right. All right. Your woman wearing cleavage out, she's being a witch. Mm -hmm. She's causing disorder. She's causing car accidents. Mm -hmm. Right? The woman wearing uh, tight, tight pants and you're driving, you know, you're driving down the street. You see a fat ass. Oh, yeah, you right? Can, you can alter. Right. I can ca cause a command. Fine. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? That's deadly, man. <laughs> Real shit. You see, that's causing um, confusion on the society. It's simple. It might seem simple to you people, but it's a big deal to the Heavenly Father, man. Mm -hmm. All right? Yeah, you you this is uh, Revelation 18 and 1. And after these things, I saw another angel come down from heaven, having great power, and the earth was lightened with his glory. And he mightily with a strong voice, saying, Babylon the great is fallen, is fallen, and become the habitation of mm -hmm. devils, and the hold of every foul spirit, and the cage of every unclean and hateful bird. Mm -hmm. Verse 3, the point. For all nations have drunk in of the wine of her wrath, her fornication, and the kings of the earth have committed fornication with her, mm -hmm. and the merchants of the earth are waxed rich through the abundance of her delicacies. That's right. So you have it to where a lot of these other nations, they come to America, man. They come to the to the west to do business okay but in the, in the midst of that right they have to pretty much sell out man the largest become boys right because they're in the land of isa either man they have to do as the romans so to speak man and we live in the new world now man right but that's the trade-off because they, they wanted they said all right we'll sacrifice the morale of our people for the money man you see what i'm saying mm -hmm. But the Lord's going to destroy with all of that, man. That's not going to be able to save you <clears throat> in that day, man. You, you, you all by thinking you're going to be the next to rule, man. Mm -hmm. No. All right, quick reset going into, uh, oh, now? you done? Yeah, there's more. Okay, go Verse 4. I got you, I got you next. Okay. And I heard another voice from heaven saying, Come out of her, my people, that ye be not partakers of her sins. That's right. And that you receive out of her place. That voice the men of the Lord on the highways and byways, okay, uh, across the four corners of the earth, man. We're, giving, we're, we're warning our people, man, to, to repent, to turn back from their wicked ways so they can experience salvation from Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai. This is your... All right? You don't want to be um, caught up in a million degree Fahrenheit. That's right. nuclear destruction, man. Okay? And the Lord has the power to, to hold your spirit in those flames, man. Don't mm -hmm. think you're going to get off easy, all right? Mm -hmm. For her sins have reached unto heaven, and Yahweh hath remembered her iniquities. That's right, man. The amount of sin in this place, the amount of wickedness, mm -hmm. okay? It's, it has reached all the way up to the heavens, man. Mm -hmm. You know? The, the angels are documenting everything that goes on in this place, mm -hmm. man. The, the Lord is already justified to destroy this place based yeah. on everything that takes <clears throat> place here, man. That alone is justifiable to put this place, to take this place up. That's right. That racket, that noise vocation, right? Yeah. Noise pollution, man. Yeah. Nonsense. Go ahead, Ark. Uh, going into uh, this place being polluted, right? Uh, Sephaniah 3 and 1. It reads, Word to her that is filthy and polluted to the oppressed city. And we can see, like you just mentioned right now, this place is polluted, right? The music that they play, the demonic. It says the first two. Of hey, first two, to obey not the voice, receive no correction, to trust it, knowing the Lord Yahweh, to draw no near to her power. Right? So Isa don't listen to the Heavenly Father. Isa wants to do what he wants to do in this place because he has the power. Right? 
But sooner or later, that's going to be uh, exterminated right. by the ICBM missiles, right? That's right. The glittering sword, right? You know? The Mosai even uh, he decked out the missiles, man. Come on. Like, you know? He had the prophet call it the glittering sword, man. <laughs> you know? Yeah, because it's saw the, the fire Thank you. coming from behind it, man. <laughs> Before it even made impact on the earth. That's right. You see what I'm saying? And that's guided, that's spiritually guided by the angels, man. Right? Yeah. Right, people, people, uh, we're visual people, so when we name things, we name things according to, to visual. Even now, um, Esau gave a lot of his weaponry names from off of Gadites, Gadite weaponry. Right, so it's, it's just something visual. It just it's just association, right? So the glittering sword or uh, uh, or the, the arrow, because well, one of the scriptures says an arrow that shot from the end of the earth. Mm -hmm. What arrow can do that? I've never seen an arrow do that before. So what arrow is it talking about? But in their mind, they're like, no, that looks like an arrow. Yeah. And it does look like an arrow when you go like this and you pull it back and you go. Whoop, it does look like an arrow. Has the same trajectory, right? Exactly. Way, you know? Exactly. That's why they that's why they, they, they also said the, the, the scroll. Right. They, 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 they said like a scroll. Right. Exactly. Right. Right. Second Ezra 15, verse 1. Behold, speak thou in the ears of my people the words of prophecy, which I'll put in my mouth. Say the Lord. Yeah, we just we just speak the prophecy. The nuclear missiles. We haven't seen a nuclear missile be shot out yet, but we envision it, right? The scriptures say so. Esau even has already created it. The, the Lord created it. these things. Okay, and it's not going to be put away into a museum, man. Oh yeah, this is going to be nuclear missile. No, man. The Lord is going to put a spirit on these nations to use these things, man, to bring forth judgment for the proud and the wicked, man. And cause them to be written in paper, for they are faithful and true. That's right, man. This is gonna be guaranteed to happen, man. Right? We believe that wholeheartedly, man. Okay? There's no, there's no doubt that these things are not coming to pass, man. Alright? The Lord has already showed you prophecy even with the big this is the COB, man, the precursor, man. Okay, where you had to have a um VAX to uh, work, right? Well, that, it's going to be the same thing for the C hip, man. You're going to need the C hip in order to work, man. Okay. Fear not the imaginations against thee. Let not the incredulity right. of them. We got 15 minute city music, too, right? They've been planning on locking you people down. That already happened, man. And it's gonna be, it's gonna be implemented even more, man. That was just a trial run, man. He saw was studying how the people were reacting. You know, he's a master psychologist. He, he wants to know how people are gonna react when he actually implements yeah, data. Right. You know, data. Yeah, data is a big thing in this society now, man. Mm -hmm. You know. And that's what human beings are. We're we're machines. We're programmed. So it's easy to study. It's it's called human nature. Right. Right. So it's easy to study. Right. Because I, I'm sorry to tell you, but every nation of people have traits. Right. The most I program everybody with a trait. So when you say, oh, Asians can't do this, or you right. black people like this, it stereotypes are real. Yeah. And Esau just knows about it. Because right. he studies it. Right. Let not the incredulity of them. They like uh, there was a skit that they did where they had a boat and then they had fried chicken. And they had watermelon, and they're like, "Hey, free food, free food!" Yeah. And then black black people are coming up, and they're just they're looking, they're just staring, and they're just like, "What the hell? What is going on?" But that that's 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 a real thing. We do like fried chicken, yeah. right? So it's some of it is not bad just because it has a bad connotation on it. That's bad, right? Like, even for a woman, the connotations of a woman is all bad, wicked, unfaithful. It's all bad, but is a woman bad? No. You just have to know how to deal with them, right? Just like an unruly child. Mm -hmm. Is a child bad? No. But if you spoil the child, right. now look. Look what you have on your hands now. Uh -huh. You have a monster. Yeah, you broke your butt. Yeah, you broke your butt. Yeah. yeah. You know? 
let not the opportunity of them trouble thee that speak against thee. Faithful shall die in their unfaithfulness. That's right, man. You know, that's why, you know, we never need to be around people that don't You know, that can knock you off your pivot, your spiritual pivot. That's it, that. You know? That's it, that. You gotta, you gotta have your mind, be mind with like minded brothers, you know? Okay? Behold, saith the Lord, I will bring plagues upon the world, the sword, famine, death, and destruction. For wickedness hath exceedingly polluted the whole earth. No, just because the Mosai wants to. Just for fun. There's a reason why the Mosai is going to destroy That's right. Things, right? That's right. Exactly. Okay? Wickedness, the brother just read, the wickedness sins that reach up to the heavens, man. Okay? And their hurtful works are fulfilled. Adultery, murder, robbery, witchcraft, idolatry, ultimately idolatry. You know? That's the main thing. People in the world, they have their roots in the right. Like you're saying, for the most part, at the end, we're at that red notice, that light thing. That's right. This is uh, Proverbs 13 and 20. Because he that walketh with wise men shall be wise, but a companion of fools shall be destroyed. Yeah. That's right. That's yeah. You know? Yeah. That's plain, man. You know, it's better to walk with wise men. The wise men will keep you sharp, keep you on point, keep you on game, man. You know? The scripture even said, you know, even if you're a fool, it's better to keep your mouth shut. You can see wise, right? You can soak up a lot of knowledge from people that know more than you, man. You know, and there's nothing wrong with hum humbling yourself, right? To know, to be around great men that, that can show you the teach you, man. That can guide you through the spirit. Therefore saith the Lord, I will hold my tongue no more as touching their wickedness, mm -hmm. which they profanely commit. Neither will I suffer them in those things. Trying, because, you know, there's a, a, a point in time, right, right now, to say the Mosai is still winking at people's right? All right? He turned his back, like, ah, whatever, we'll let you guys do your thing. You know, but don't think he's not documented it. And he's, like I said, he's justified in putting the people to death, man. Okay? He's just letting it bubble up, even though it's already bubbled up. He's still letting it bubble up, man, until the time is right, man. Until the elect is sealed. He's holding back the four corners of the earth. The four winds like that. Okay. In which they wickedly exercise themselves. Behold, the innocent and righteous blood crieth unto me. The innocent and the righteous blood crieth unto the heavenly father. Uh, the elect men, you know, they're signing and crying because of the abominations thereof, man. Every day, every, you turn on the news, you see a whole bunch of wickedness, man. Right? We have a little chat, we see a bunch of filth that's taking place. Right? And the souls of the just complain continually. You're not complaining, man. You're not right. You know? You're not in the right spirit. You know? So, you know, you got to examine yourself, man. You really, you know, rubbing shoulders and... Edomites and these wicked guys two third niggas and thinking it's all good, right? You know, you're having a good time, this festival in this, in this, in this whirlwind of shit, right? Come on. And therefore saith the Lord, I will surely avenge them and receive unto me all the innocent blood from among them. Behold, my people is led as a flock to the slaughter. I will not suffer them now to dwell in the land of Egypt. A lot of our people right now are being uh, lined up for the slaughter, man. Okay, you, 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 you especially Jake's the third, man. Okay, you're getting geared up to take the seat here, man. When they, when they say, there's no, when they say there's no more food, or they're rationing out the food, right? And then, you know, with this whole housing crisis, these these Edom, these elites are setting up something for you that you have to depend on them, man. You need them. You're not gonna be able to try and make some work on, on the side or not, nah, man. They're gonna set up a system where it's gonna be digitally tracked, digitally monitored. <laughs> well, we, are, we already do, brother. Right? The elder brother just mentioned 
Brother Connor Rock just mentioned the uh, Squid Games. That's what Squid Games is all about. So we're already dependent on money, right? right? So when they discontinue money, they're go we're gonna be definitely uh, um, dependent on whatever form of currency that they issue. Right. We're already dependent. Look at us. Look what we will do for money, man. I'll show you videos in my phone of what people do for money. It's scary, man. God. It's actually scary what people do for money, man. So imagine when everything that these people have worked hard for is gone to the dust. Mm -hmm. And then Esau says that you have to take this mm -hmm. or else you don't eat. Man, come on, man. You people have already sold your souls yeah. for the cash. What the heck is with the thing? You're already, you're already done. Go back to normal, right? There's <laughs> women out there. You let guys shit on you. There's rich white men that shit on you just for money. Mm -hmm. Because that's their proclivities and you feel like, oh yeah, yeah, I'm better than him. Oh, he's he's a trick or he's this. But he shits on you. Or he pisses on you. Or you women, you fly over there to Dubai to, to, to get to get ravished. And it's all for money, man. Yep. So you people have already sold out for money, man. Even 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 people that don't do stuff like that, you've already sold your for your job because you're not supposed to work a job like that. No man's supposed to work a job like that till you go home and your your back is broken and that's not how life is supposed to be, man. To where you're seeing your mom going to work at 60. That's evil, man. All of that is evilness, man. Go ahead. But I will bring them with a mighty hand and a stretched out arm and smite Egypt with plagues as before and will destroy all the land thereof. Egypt shall mourn and the foundation of it shall be Hey, and what was Egypt? Hey, you see you see the spirit of the Most High? What was Egypt, brother? Does anybody know where my, my mind is going? Egypt was a place of bondage. Egypt was a place of hardship. That's what this place is. And even in Egypt, we got custom to the hardship that we wanted to go back. Remember, what did Pharaoh say? Pharaoh said, we're going to afflict them more. I forgot what, where that is, but Exodus 1 or something, where he said, yeah, we're going to punish them because they, they're outnumbering us. Right? Go ahead, up. And will destroy all the land thereof. Egypt shall mourn, and the foundation of it shall be smitten with the plague and punishment that Yahweh shall bring upon it. They that till the ground shall mourn, for their seed shall fail through the blast, through the blasting and hail. That's right, Bill Gates. He, he wants to be buying up all the farm, right? Like he has all these extensive plans to, you know, to feed the world or whatever, to keep up with whatever. And that's what they're doing, right? They're cutting, they're cutting off the whole thing. Right, right. So people like the Amish and the private farmers in that time, guess what? They're going to confiscate it as well. Oh. Right? Yep. Because they're going to say, oh, you know, it's pathogens in the chicken, you can't have that, you can't have this. That's right. Right? And they sell eggs for cheap. They sell for cheap. And people can still go to them. Yep. And the time we're coming into, even the barter system won't work. Right? Even the barter system won't work because things are going to be cut off. Hey, just to back you up, Elder, they did that to Jamaica. The IMF did that to Jamaica. So when they brought in um, international trade into Jamaica, and uh, other countries got to, to, to trade their foods and stuff that was grown in Jamaica and could be bought in Jamaica. They said, oh, you guys don't package it properly. Oh, so we don't accept it. It has to be packaged this way. Or it has to go through this. Or it has to go through that. So they, yeah, certain, certain safety stuff. And they destroyed the whole farming industry in Jamaica. Make them dependent. Yeah, I know. Right. Right. And that made them dependent on trade from outside right exactly and they're, they're importing more than they export so any nation that's imported more than they export is at a deficit man they're not their economy is is low sure. so, you know? so, it's a consumer nation. right just like this society it's a consumer nation mm -hmm. right and now you're seeing all these people coming to this side of the world man. they live different lives man right so now they're coming here but this place is about to about to come <laughs> No? <laughs> Season two. <laughs> For their seed shall fail through the blasting and hail, and with a fearful constellation. Woe to the world and them that dwell therein. For the sword and their destruction draweth nigh. 
how one people shall stand and fight against another and swords in their hands. That's right. That's going into World War III. No swords, they talk about that. Swords that's made out of a sign. All right? Some cities, they'll have that 5G lock, 15 minute lockdown. Yes. Some cities will be anarchy, some cities will be abandoned. That's Just right. Rooms. That's right. You can have all kinds of situations. That's right. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. They showed us that in Gotham, where they had to blow the bridge. And they say, hey, fuck you guys. You guys can't come over here. <laughs> <laughs> For there shall be sedition among men and invading one another. They shall not regard their kings nor princes, and the course of their actions shall stand in their power. A man shall desire to go into a city. You're gonna have, you're gonna have notices, return inside, right? <laughs> return to your home, there's a curfew, right? So, some cities will get off with enforcing it, but some cities, like I said, man, there's, there's gonna be total anarchy. Shoot outside. Yeah, shoot outside, that's right. A man shall desire to go into a city and shall not be able for because of their pride, the city shall be troubled, the houses shall be destroyed, and men shall be afraid. That, that incident that happened on uh, Rainbow Bridge is, is gearing up to implement your people's, uh, being locked down in your homes, man. Because they're going to say, oh, terrorist attacks are on the place, or terrorist attacks are happening. Okay? It's a great excuse for you, for you people to stay inside. Right? Because people are going to automatically fear, man. You know? Yeah, those are called primates. Right. They're priming you. Yep. Right? That's what the whole uh, Palestine Israel thing was. And then when you, because where I live, I live around them Khazars. Right? I live around Avenue. And they had the police there. They had the police also in Vaughan. Certain places in Vaughan. Different places where a lot of Khazars are. And the, the police are there because they're like, oh, we're, 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 we're here to defend against hate crime mm -hmm. or terrorist uh, acts of terrorism. So they're priming you. Because you have to wonder, if that was just a car accident, why was the news so quick to call it terrorism? Because they're ready for something. They're ready for anything. The news is ready to prime you people. Anything. It doesn't matter what it is. They're ready to push that agenda, man. And what's the agenda? Fear. Because you, they found oh, out that you people man, work off of fear, man. What? You're bitch ass right. people oh, because they got you to do what you did two, three years ago because of fear. And that's the first time in the history of mankind that the whole globe was on lockdown. Never in the history of mankind did any ruler, any ruler, think of any ruler, the baddest rulers on the world and the planet could never do something like that. And you people are fucking with that man Esau right now. He was able to walk down the whole globe. <laughs> and that's who you're fucking with. It's our evil brother, man. He's no joke. It's his earth. Yeah, man. A man shall have no pity upon his neighbor, but shall destroy their houses with the sword and spoil their goods because of bread and for great tribulation. Behold, saith Yahweh, I will call together all the kings of the earth to reverence me, which are from the rising of the sun, from the south, from the east, and living us to turn themselves one against another and repay the things that they have done to them. Repay the things that I have done to them, according to Joel 3, man. Okay? They afflicted the children of Israel. All right? And for the Heavenly Father's sake, he's going to avenge his people. Okay. By doing what? By implementing World War III, man. That's the only way. He's going to have it to where all nations are going to go toe to toe against each other. All right. And then in the midst of that, yeah, the Shai is going to come, man. And he's never day. Subdue all nations, subdue all governments. With the power that's coming, man. Yeah. Right? It's heavenly entity. Um, okay. There's nothing people are gonna do, man. Super simulation, man. Alright. Um, Exodus one and six. 
and Joseph died, and all and all brethren, and all, and all his brethren, and all that and children of Israel were fruitful and increased abundantly and multiplied, and multiplied and waxed exceedingly mighty, and the land was filled with them. And there arose up a new king over Egypt, which was not Joseph, and are it says and he said unto his people you know the people of the children of Israel are more mighty and are more and more mightier than than we that us hey and tell me tell me that's not true hey there was a, a comedian by the name of Cat Williams talking about this he's just like niggas don't care nothing about governor or whatever he was saying he's like then they watch and it's true you know why it's true because every new ruler brings a new spirit brings a new energy even a new mayor when the crackhead was ruling niggas were good it was a good time it was good times great time right so certain rulers are cool with you niggas and then certain rulers like um stephen harper remember that dude wasn't cool. He put hell on you, you so-called niggas. When I was a kid, kids were out of school all the time. There was a lot of strikes. A guy named Mike Harris. They're called the Mike Harris days. He messed up the whole city. He messed up the whole 90s, man. Right? So certain rulers bring a certain type of energy, man. And it's true. Come, come on and let us deal wisely with them. Did Obama not bring a certain type of energy? Yeah. Did Trump not bring a certain type of energy? Now look at Biden. And we we told you we told you people that I seen the elder post some stuff about him going into the chip from before a lot of people. That's why I'm touching the elder. But they were showing me stuff about Biden since the 80s. Mm. Biden was a demon from the 80s. This brother did lessons on him as well. Going back to the 90s, it's 2000. So when he came into power, everybody knew. Oh shit. Oh, oh shit. We're fucked. Go ahead. Come on. He said, come on. Let us deal wisely with them. Let's they multiply. And that's what the lady just said from Israel. There's a lady that just came from Israel and she said, our biggest threat is you young black men. Generation. Young, you young black generation. And you know who the hell she's talking about. It's not talking about you niggas selling drugs and smoking weed. What are you a threat to? You're perfect for the prison industrial complex. So what are you a threat to? You're perfect for the, to be a drug pusher. You guys are drug pushers, right? But who's the biggest threat? You men who are waking up the, the people on the side. That's the threat. You have to you, you have to deduce these things. How could a nigga be a threat when they're following the rules of Esau? Go ahead. Come on, let us deal wisely with them, lest they multiply and they come to pass. And that's what they're saying about us. Because we're on the corner and we're waking up our people to who they truly are, and we're starting to follow the law, statutes, and commandments, they said we have to what? Read that part again. Come on, let us deal wisely with them. Come on, let us deal wisely with them. That's what they say. They have a uh, uh, Project Megiddo. They have a whole thing called Project Megiddo. That's called dealing wisely with them, man. They try to set us up for terrorism attacks in New Jersey. That's dealing wisely with us, man. They set people up like Nathaniel, Nate, Satan, and all these different people that have came and tried to to to, um, to, to vilify us, man. And it's so crazy that strangers came to our our aid through the spirit of Yahweh Hashem Shai. Strangers said, "Who those guys? All those guys do is read the Bible. What are you guys talking about?" They don't threaten nobody. All those guys do is come out and read the Bible. That's it. It was strangers that defended us, man. So they're going to have to be very careful on how they come at us, man. So the only way they really can come at us is if they have, um, what do you call those people? Info, no, how did you know? The water for reading my brain. Infiltrators. If they have somebody that infiltrate the camp and does something wicked in the camp, and then they can tie it to GMS, man. Infiltrators or spies or whatever you call it. There's other names for them, man. Go ahead. 
come on, let us deal wisely with them, lest they multiply and they come to pass. Hey, that's how they took down the Black Panthers. How do you think they took down the Black Panthers? They took down the Black, Black Panthers through infiltrators, even though the Black Panthers was already a Luciferian organ, organization, but it's always going to be infiltrators people that come and insert themselves into what we do. But that's why this thing is so spiritual because at the end of the day, somebody get uh, 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 the word. What is the word? The word is quick and powerful. That's why this is so beautiful, man. We don't have to have you you guys doing push-ups. It's the word that's gonna suss you out, man. When we step on your damn, your, your, your feet here, if you're, if you're an infiltrator, this pisses you off. It, it hurts you when we tell you the things that your society is going down, and we tell you that hey, show them show them we tell you your society is going down, and we tell you the things you don't want to hear, and we show you according to the Bible. It hurts. It hurts. Somebody got that? Uh, bring it up. We're about to show. Uh, Hebrews four and twelve. For the word of the Most High is quick and powerful. So it has nothing to do with our strength. It has nothing to do with our skill. The elder knows how to do Wing Chun. <laughs> but he's, he's not going to use Wing Chun on you. <laughs> not, not worrying in it. You know, <laughs> we're going to use the word. Go ahead. And sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing even to the dividing asunder of soul and spirit. And that's what's happening to you. So no matter what you do, the longer you stay around us, you're either going to be converted and healed because the Most High wants you to be, or you're going to be revealed because this is going to happen to you. The, the sword is going to stab you up until you bleed out spiritually, man. And of the joints and marrow, and, a, and is a discerner of the thoughts and intents of the heart. And the longer you stay into this truth and really let the spirit of the Habar Shemiah shine, Come in onto you, like it says in Revelation. You know what's gonna happen to you? You're gonna be able to read people spiritually. It's gonna be easy. We're gonna already know who you are because the spirit is gonna let us know. The spirit, and, and guess what? We're gonna be having counsel about you, and you're not even gonna know we're having counsel about you. Because we're gonna be like, I don't know, something's off. And then we're gonna talk and we're gonna watch you, and you're not even gonna know we're watching you, but we're fucking watching you. Like a fucking hawk, and we're hey, shalom. Hey, 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 shalom. Not even knowing that we're about to chop your head off spiritually, man. <laughs> Do you have us in your side? Go ahead. You saw, also, I just wanted to make a point because you're absolutely right. Because even during the course of COVID, you see that now you have a lot of people that are watching a lot of other videos. And the article came out that a lot of them were being converted. By a lot of the video, so you can see that happening on the lower level right now. But imagine when it happens in full effect later on. That's right. Yeah, the elder is right. They are being converted when they watch the videos on YouTube, especially the people who are against the chief. That's right. Yeah, of course. This is Romans chapter 16, verse 17. Now I beseech you, brethren, mark them which cause divisions. And that's all we do. And marking them doesn't mean like a woman, right? Because when a woman is angry, <laughs> she has to create a problem. We're just marking you. We're gonna take our time, right? That's one thing that I've learned from this brother, right? It's patience. You just be patient. Go ahead. Mark them that cause divisions and offensive, contrary to the doctrine, which ye you have- You heard what it said? Contrary to the doctrine. Not you you could not like somebody but that's your feet going against the law statutes and commandments your actions that's what we're marking you on we're not just marking you because hey you know that guy walks with a limp i don't like i don't like his haircut i don't like the way he dresses go ahead which ye have learned and avoid them for they that are such servants power, Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, but their own belly. Hey, and that's a tell. There's going to be a tell. His tell is that he serves his own belly with our own eyes, man. I'm sorry, to, I'm sorry for anybody. He could be converted. When you have that, that you 
ain't gonna be converted back. And it's not because of the money, it's because of the because of the money. The heck it's not because of the money. Money is just a damn tool. So any man that knows how to use the tool of money, you're good. But if and I could tell that he loves money with that high, mighty pride that he has. He thinks all of that was go ahead. And by good work is deceive the hearts of the symbols. Right? There's a lot of people that know how to deceive. They're actors. Right? So you got to be careful of actors as well. Not that you're going to be over vigilant. It's not about that. And first of all, that's not, that's not even a spirit for you young The spirit that you need to be in is getting this knowledge, wisdom, and understanding. Revelation comes to uh, uh, the spirit of the most high. It doesn't come to you being Sherlock Holmes, man. Right. Uh, this is Exodus 1 and 10. Come on, let us deal wisely with them, lest they multiply and they come to pass that when the uh, and when they fall if out so unto our enemies and fight against us and so get them up out of the land therefore they did set up over them taskmasters with their burdens and they And they built, uh, they built and Ramses. But it's like a, like a savior. Think that you were the Egyptians. In slavery, building up the city. Okay? Uh, after, because at first, like, first you have, uh, like, they have, like, like, they have Joseph, and then, and, like, we were dwelling there. Like amongst the Hamite, when the uh, like when the uh, when the Egyptian came up, whatever, uh, like, like when Ramses came, whatever, and, like we started catching hell. Right? Egyptian, right? It was, it was a citizenship. So like today, you have men. I'm American. Like you tell a, tell a man you're in Israel, I'm American, I'm Canadian, I'm Jamaican. Uh, even today, I was talking to, 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 my, to my, my my brother's wife, and I'm talking to a collective. You? I'm like, all of us. Like, oh, you. And she didn't like that, but she just, she just kept it cool because I was paying her breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> but what do you think? She, she, she don't want to be called an Israelite. Okay, so, so you, have, you have Jake today, my mindset, they want to be with what's cool. Light is a nation, all right. It's not. It's, it's not. A, it's not. A, it's not like a um, um, like what Jesus says. You're Canadian. Or you're Jamaican. No, we're, we just have a man called Jacob. What's mixed with Israelites? Oh, well, I'm, I'm second generation. God. Yeah. <laughs> God. First of all, I'm not African. God. You just say that you're an indigenous of the land. He's Israeli now because of the conflict. <laughs> therefore, it says, it's not, it said, therefore, and at one time, didn't he dress up like as a Roman or a gladiator? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, yeah, he's, he's a, yeah, he had everything. God. And he was in the chariot. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 it said, therefore, they did set over them taskmaster to afflict them with their burdens, and they built for Herod. That's the, that's the point, man. Right? They put on that hard uh, 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 captivity on us, man. That's what, they're that, still doing it. Exactly. And, cut, they, cut. <laughs> and then even in the captivity, they have different schemes, different little works that they do on Jake. Yeah. The, the pitfalls that they put him in. Hell yeah. You know, they oppress the widow, the scripture says. You know? Yeah, I mean, like I said, it's not that. I said, but the more they afflicted them, the more they grew 
and like and they were grievous because of the children of Israel. Yeah, like Lazarus, right? It said Lazarus he was in hell pretty much, which is the state. And then it said the dogs came, he had swords, and the dogs came and licked his swords, man. Right? Which of the other nations so when swords Esau gave him and the mother nations come and add insult to him. So, and, the, and the Egyptian made the children of Israel to serve with to serve with rigor. And they and, and, like, and they made their lives bitter with hard bondage. In like in mother and in brick and all manner of service in the field. All and it's like and all their services, where they made them serve with rigor, and the and it's like and the, and the king of to the Hebrew midwives. No support. Yeah. Okay. Well, yeah, well, anybody have something? Well, this is too much for. He says. Um, and that because of false brethren and awares brought in, we can be privileged to spy out the liberty which we have in the Mashiach, our Shai, that they might bring us to bondage. That's right, because the brother had brought up the point about uh, infiltrators, right? You know, so there might be false brothers in the camp, wherever they are, okay, just trying to spy out our liberty, right? Thinking of how they can take us down. You see what I'm saying? Trying to know a, a brother's day to day is what he does in his, you know, what he does in his daily life when he's not at the camp, right? But coming off as a friend, coming off, you know, like he's cool, like, yeah, you know, whatever, however way he's doing it, man. You see what I'm saying? And then, could be your woman, right? Right, exactly. Could be your damn woman, right? You look, you're gonna be there looking at a brother, but it could be your damn woman that you live with a lady, right? <laughs> woman, that's could be yeah. children, whoever, man. Probably, probably work up a Nobody believes. Yes. <laughs> right. <laughs> Sent the link to your team. Yes. <laughs> right. Oh, that happened to that be so out there. Huh? People, people sending the link to the other YouTube channel. That was the point. That was the point. Let me get this then. Uh, this is uh, Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 2 and 1. For the ungodly said, reasoning with themselves, but not aright. Our life is short and tedious, and in the death of a man there is no remedy. Neither was there any man known to have returned from the grave. Verse 2, for we are born at all venture, and we shall be hereafter as though we had never been. Um, for the breath in our nostrils is as a smoke and a little spark in the moving of our heart, which being extinguished, our body shall be turned into ashes and our spirit shall vanish as the soft air and our name shall be forgotten in time and no man shall have and our that, works. That, 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 that breath in the nostril, remember in, in Genesis, it says the most high grows breath to Adam, even the, the ways of not understanding. So they're saying they never got it. They were pain to see, vanity, right? They're just built for a certain thing, man. You don't understand. They're built to deceive. They're built to tell lies. So don't go to this man to place of higher learning, so-called higher learning, to get any truth. It's gonna be futile. Mm -hmm. Like, get it. We're telling you the so-called white man is the devil, is the wicked. So I saw this research, you know, and Kumio Aya, Elder, Awa, Kumio Romeo, yeah, like, like this man is bugged out, right? He says some truth, but as Elder said, pointed out to me, this man, people are cutting him on, 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 on his comment board, man, because like he's going to things he, he shouldn't be going into. Because yes, the tribes were here before, and they were called, the, like the land, that's the land they called where they came from. So, so this was Egypt. So if what, what, like like if I go somewhere, you have little Jamaica and Canada, you have little Portugal, you have this, and you call things by the name that you're you're accustomed to. Mm -hmm. So yes, in the right thing, this is Egypt and the Nile. So the man saying this is where it all started. And it's okay, bro. Keep Jeez. saying that. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because that's why you mean destroy with the missiles. Because if you think it's gonna be somewhere else, hey man, we're saying it is what it is. The Bible says it's mystery Babylon. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
So, so, the, so, the, so, the, so, the, so the, the, the wicked, the, the, the knowledge that they have is not knowledge, man. It's, it's made to deceive the world. So, where is he saying is Egypt? Or Babylon, um, America. Yeah, but that that wouldn't that wouldn't because the, the, the scriptures tells you about where the rivers were, God. the four rivers. God. So God. That, that still wouldn't make any right. sense. Uh, verse four, and our name shall be forgotten in, in time, and no man shall have our works in remembrance, and our life shall pass away as the trace of a cloud. And so, shall so, so so they're speaking truth and life at the same time, right? Because we don't remember them in a way that they won't be remembered. They're gonna be like 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 like, like um, ghost stories, man. Right? Your ghost stories is gonna be about them. Hey, go to bed or get eat them. Ah! And and I wrote the bed because you know what's an Edomite? Okay, the wild man. Mm -hmm. So that's going to be the story in our kingdom. So, so they know a, this. It's the same nightmares that they have about us God, coming back God. into real Spook. They call us spook, right? And spook, they so say we're spooky. So everything is to be turned back into these curses we turn out to them. Like that story about the boogeyman to get you. Who did the boogeyman was? Right? <laughs> it says, um, and shall be dispersed as a mist that is driven away with the beams of the sun and overcome with the heat thereof. And For the heat thereof is going to the missiles, man. Right? That's the that, that's that climax of, 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 of everything that's to come. Them missiles is going to cleanse the earth of the cancer, and the ca the cancer is so-called white man. All right, oh, that's the cancer oh. of the earth. Right? Verse five: For our time is very sh is a very shadow that passes away, and after our there is no returning. Hey, they're just not back there. They're, 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 they're eating my babies. We're singing a song, and, and, and I heard them say, I'm dead, I'm dead. I'm... That was a chorus. All right? That's the chorus of the, of the, of the people's song, man. They're dead, they're dead. So that's the spirit they're coming. They're coming at dead spirits. Habakkuk says, Who is as death? All right? That man represents death, man. So don't go in there for anything as, as, as life giving. Right? That, that promotes life. Right? You can't even breathe. The air you're breathing is not air. The food you're eating is not food. The clothes you're wearing shouldn't be wearing. You should be mixed with fabrics. All right? The girl you're, you're lusting after, yeah, I'll kill that. Be careful. All right? <laughs> hey, it is what it is, man. That's the world we're living in. Right? <laughs> this world is topsy turvy. The only truth you're going to get is tuning into the live streams. That's it. The truth is in the Bible. Right? It is no two truths, and, and, and he knows one truth, one Yahweh, one Yahweh's choice. It says, come on, therefore, let us enjoy the good things that are present. We tell you that. We say, have a good time. Don't we say that time? You think we're joking? We agree. Have a good time. Drink all the loot of 13th and 14th, right? Go on your yachts. You know what I mean? Do your thing. Because in our kingdom, you're not going to be able to. Right? We'll be, you think, you think that, 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 that noise? Hey, no. Them kids, we're going to be in your house, man. That, that, that's, that's irritating. I, I was listen, listening to it on the way down the, 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 the camp, and I was like, can you imagine the viewers with two together? Ah, you know? But we, we have to bear it. Lot was, Lot was vexed with this filthy conversation. That's a filthy conversation. Mm -hmm. I'm dead. Ah, what the hell is that, man? You know what I mean? That's crazy. <laughs> You have to laugh at it because what, what, what are we going to do? We're, we're helpless. We can't do shit. You know, well, where's our rights? Oh, we have the right to say, hey, I'm box all those kids sent them into their house, man. We, say, we're, we, we understand where we are. We're in Babylon. That's confusion. Did anybody know? No, no, I heard I'm dead. Did anybody hear other words? Mm -hmm. No. <laughs> Whatever. It says, come, come on, therefore, let us enjoy the good things that are present and let us speedily use the creatures like as in youth. That's right, so in youth, where they have, you see, in youth, we're in Egypt building it up, right? Egypt was a place, right, that glorious kingdom. It's been spoken of today, right, how great it was. Who built it up? We did. So like, this is called spiritual sum in Egypt, we're doing the same thing, all right? But now we're not building it up again like how we did before the man of the Lord. We're, we're looking for, for our kingdom to come, right? And this is how we build our kingdom. This, this is our third temple right here. Yeah, yeah. Oh, this third temple in Jerusalem. Do your, do your thing. All right. If that's what you want to call it, call it what you want to call it. No, it's not. It's not going to be like a, 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 right. This we're doing is nuclear proof. This is nuclear exemption material. You're looking at. Hopefully, where hopefully those men will be exempted from from the coming destruction, mm -hmm. and it's coming. All right. <laughs> it says, "Let us fill ourselves with costly wine, 
and ornaments and ointments. Hey, you know what's costly wine? Christian doctrine. Paying for to go to the theologian seminary school. That's a costly wine, man. We know they're talking about like a literal thing, but costly wine, you know, you have years and years and, 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 and see reading books and you know and, and one of these little by your name. That's some costly wine. This is free. And it's, 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 it's y'all should say, say the last wine for last. This is the last wine that y'all should say. All right, remember when we actually turned turn water into wine? This was this was what, what it was. The water became wine, but it's good wine. The gospel, the good spell. This is what I deal with. Okay? It says, let us fill ourselves with costly wine and ointments and let no flower of the spring pass by us. Let us crown ourselves with rosebuds before they be withered. I'm so-and-so. I'm this, I'm that. <laughs> All quick, quick, what? <laughs> All right, I'm king this, I'm president this, I'm prime minister this, you know, I'm this one. Listen, man, take all the names and the accolades that you want of this world, because this world is garbage. It's shit, right? It's done. Okay, we're waiting on the Lord. We'll be, be the feeble. Well, guess what? Yahweh, by Shem Shai, calls feeble. He said, best of the meek, best of the lowly. We're the lowly. We're good with that. We're, 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 we're the base people. We're good with that. Why? Because the Lord said that we are. Not because you said that we are. The Bible said that we're the, we're the, we're the, we're the meek, the lowly, right? And we're, we're, we're going to be humble. Humble doesn't mean a, mean a nigga with, like a, with, a, with a soft tone. That doesn't mean you're humble, man. Because all you damn niggas that speak like that, like that are wicked as hell, man. Okay? Mm -hmm. Humble means that you're, you're willing to repent and adhere to the Lord, statutes and commandments. Be subjects to what? Righteousness. Mm -hmm. Okay? Let none of us go without his part of our voluptuousness. Let us leave tokens of our joyfulness in every place. In our kingdom, as I said, there'll be no need tokens, man. No sign that we're standing up with a sword or not. That ain't gonna be there, man. Your token will be like a foot of your ass. That's gonna be like a, like, like a token. So what's over there? Oh, that's that's gonna kick, kick, kick your ass. All the statues will be like us kicking your ass, man. That's it. For this is our portion, and our lot is this. See, they know that part of scripture. They're right. Jacob blessing was from at the end, and Esau was the feathers of the earth. They know that. You think you think the upper echelon of the, if Esau don't know what the hell is going on? Manifest destiny. <laughs> they know what's going on. Just you peons, just like how in, 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 in Israel, you got our people two thirds don't know what's going on in their uh, 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 um, kingdom with a rule over, right? Which is everybody. They don't know what's going on. But the oppression knows it's, it's a struggle, it's a wrestle, right? We're wrestling with our, with our cell phones and, and, and a tripod and, and a light. They got ammunitions, they got uh, um, satellites, right? Going, around, go, go, going about the earth and looking at what you're doing and, and, and turning at your TV on while you're sleeping, watching you freak your woman. But he's a freak, all right? Yo, when I'm with a woman sometimes, I do it for the camera, man. I'm not watching, right? <laughs> I do it for the camera sometimes. All right. <laughs> Let us oppress the poor, righteous man. See that the poor, righteous man. You niggas ain't rich, man. Talking about Diddy's thirty. What, what the? <laughs> what's no, no. Is it thirty million in gold, or is thirty million as he says in promissory notes? That's why I can take it so easy. That's why I give it to you so much. You're a you're a billionaire, and uh, uh, you're a millionaire, and uh, you know, gives him gold. Done. Like right? right? You have to. And you're forgetting the more you have, the more you have to give to the tax man. That's right. So you're forgetting that that 30 million can literally just be 15 after the tax is right. done. Okay. It says, let us oppress the poor righteous man. Let us not spare the widow, nor uh, reverence the ancient gray hairs of the age. And the widow is what? A widow is, 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 a, is, a, is a woman who was married. Okay, so who were married to? How about Shemir Shai? So her husband is not around right now. It's coming back. We know this through the scriptures. Right? We don't believe that anymore. We know that now. Okay, because first it's truth you believe, then you know. Okay, that's what gives you conviction. That's what makes you do this because you, you, you can change your belief. I don't believe it anymore. Once you know something, you know something. Mm -hmm. We know the Lord is Yahweh, is the Father, Heavenly Father. We know the Son is Yahweh Shai, and we know that we're Israelites through the Spirit. As the other said earlier on, if you're an Israelite man and a man step up on, uh, on your Savior, you feel some kind of way, man. Mm -hmm. You know, you, you feel offended. Yeah, why step up to Jesus? <laughs> I heard him say before, well, why, why did Jesus have a horn? 
because Jesus, Jesus is a devil. <laughs> Jesus is a damn devil. That's right. All right? Yahweh Shah is our king. That's right. Okay? That's what we deal with over here. We will do it casually if you come up here and you want to know and ask, why is that? We explain to you. That ain't our Lord. That's the description in the Bible. Okay? The Psalm said that the wicked uh, um, speak among, them, uh, among themselves without a right. That's what they come up with. That's, that's not right. That's their, that's their depiction. I know it saved them. Right? That's their savior. God. It says, let our strength be the law of justice. See that? All, all heck of them is wicked, unrighteous, a pedophile, a thief, a murderer, talking about, he even talking about justice. That don't make no sense at all. They all talking about your critical thinking. You, you want them comment, them comment, them, them truthers? You have a critical thing. Hey, that's not critical thinking. How are you gonna be a damn criminal and talk about your just law? You're just you're trying to be justice. It's injustice, man. There's no justice in, in this kingdom. It's all righteous, upside down. Okay, you have women in the place of men, women in the army. That's what it's getting. It's getting some some getting rinsed out, right? Because you have no place being there. A lot of girls are sexy too, man. Okay, uh, in war because uh, they're in shape. Huh? Yeah, they get in really good shape. But in they war, they have to they have to be disciplined. That's one thing they don't have outside. It's discipline. What? It says, let our strength be the law of justice, for that which is feeble is found to be nothing worth. They say, they say the so-called Negroes, they call us blacks. Negro and black is the same word. Nigger, Negro, black is the same word. You just, you just accept the English version of the word, right? Ask them, what's a nigger? It's just a bad thing, man. That's what I'm saying. Why? I'll tell you, it's integrated. Oh, how? Hey, give me, I, I'm supposed to be offended. Tell me why I should be offended. Uh, it's just something you don't say, man. Just, why? Because the word has no meaning. It's dumb. It just means black in, 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 in Latin, right? Necro means dead. Mm -hmm. it's, a, it's, a, it's a word that the so called white men use to, to, to make things aspire. It has no power. That's why we say we're not black, nothing. We're Hebrew Israelites. That's it. That's right. It says, therefore, let us lie in wait. For the righteous, he is not for our turn. You hear that? You hear that, Israelite men? The so-called white man, woman and child, is planning for your ass, man. Try to come smile on your face. Well, well, what are you guys doing? What, are you <laughs> doing? What's this about? He says, let us lay, lay and wait for them. And it's, the peon, hey, you're not saying that. He wants to be your friend. You're a hey dude, right? He's a hey dude. Right, but it's but it's the, the echelons, they're watching you, man. They walk by, they got cameras all over the place, right? There's no police are there, you know. They, 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 they're, they're scheming. That's their that's what they put here. They, they put here to wrestle with Jacob. The echelons know that. The peon don't know shit. Right? He just won hey man, in a half quarter later, in a half quarter. That's all in his mind. A couple of bears, right? That's good for him. It says, therefore, let us lie in wait. For the righteous, because he is not for our turn. He didn't say Puff Daddy or Little Boozy or Mace. He said for the righteous. They said them guys are good. They're doing Esau's bidding. Beyonce shaking her shaking her ass right now, telling you dumbass bitches to the man to the less of She's married. How is a married woman is telling you to the man put a ring on it and, and tell to, to the left to the left. Are you gonna listen to her? You love her? She's she's speaking two 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 two, two, two um, uh, she has two tongues. Right? She should be a single and telling you that. But she's married to a nigga, a pedophile. STD. He has STDs. See that? <laughs> I just want to add, you know, they keep uh, all the oppressed and righteous man. They do, they do everything in their power to keep uh, Yahweh Bashem or Shai away from you. Right? They do everything so you can curse the righteous acts. Everything in the society is geared towards you being a pagan. That's what they want you to do to keep you, to, to keep you in that loop of going off. Constantly, and that's why they made such a conscious effort to hide the truth all these years, and they're still doing it to this very day. And that's why uh, all these different social media platforms they come against the men of the Lord that are upright, mm -hmm. the ones who are trying to push the word, and the ones who are actually trying to listen. They do everything in their power to get rid of this word, and that's to keep you down. That's another thing opposing to that. It says. Therefore, let us lie in wait for the righteous, because he is not for our turn, and he is clean, contrary to our doings. That's right. We're not about this um, HDTV 
extra slash forward pound. We're not for this stuff, man. All right? And there's laws against it. Right now, um, um, the pizza, Elon Musk, right? You can Google it. Elon Musk is bringing that, that pizza game thing up again. Because, like, I don't know, this man is a double agent. Yeah. Because, because this man is showing you, he built something, he said, this is the most powerful rocket known to man ever made. That's why it, it was this, described as. NASA didn't really contest it. said, no, it is uh, Apollo was. So no one said nothing about it, what, how he named it. He shut it off, right? And we watched it on TV go up in the air and come back down. So he's basically saying, you guys are full of shit. Because it didn't go to, it, it bounced on something and came back down. Because <laughs> we can't leave the front, we can't leave the earth, man. You can't leave. Okay, so he, he just exposed you devils, right? Yeah, they, they had a Hennessy commercial. No, no, no. no. They showed you that they, they, they go to the space and then they, they keep going, going, and then there's like some water and then they bounce. And they the man's exposed you, so the, the, the mother put a spirit on him, right? To expose you, he's a demon himself. Okay, let me see him. How about some, some, um, what, what do you call it? Illuminati, which is some oh, yeah. bullshit. Oh, yeah, he's super, he, he, you know, and, and, but he's going both ways. Mm -hmm. Double minded man, because his thing is called X or something. What's his space program? Space SpaceX. Yeah. SpaceX. Yeah. Yeah. So, so, space, space Osiris, mm -hmm. yeah, that goes back to the, the hidden god. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. exactly. The same as you Black Panther idiots. God. Yeah. <laughs> it says, therefore, let us lie in wait for the righteous because he is not for our turn and he is clean contrary to our doings. Mm -hmm. He upbraided us with our offending the law and objected to our infamy, the transgression of our education. That's right. So we're, 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 the education is basically to dumb us down. Like, I feel sorry for my son. He does online school and they shit that tennis man. I'm, I'm glad that Moses gave me the truth so I can, I can brainwash him after. Right? Because he's a good mark. So you have to let him do the food that you're trying to do. You know, but I said, son, it doesn't matter. You know? <laughs> That's right, man. That's right. It says, he professed to have the knowledge of Yahweh and he called it himself the child of the Lord. Yes, we do. We do that, and we do have the knowledge, because what? There's a secret. Amos 3, 6 and 7 tells you the most High gives you a secret. It tells you the secrets are the most size in Deuteronomy 29, 29, right? But it, it belongs to uh, 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 the children. Uh, up, up. Can you bring it up? I don't want to mess it up. Um, Deuteronomy 29, 29, about the All right? So this ain't, 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 no, ain't no, no novel, no, no, no Mills and Boone, or hard, hardcore novel, where you pick it up and say, oh, it's lovely, you know? It, it, it's so romantic. Or, or, or it's a murder mystery. You know, even though he loved that shit, murder mystery. Listen, man, we know mystery murder in our kingdom. Soon as you do it, judgment. 100%. All right. Okay, you know, 29, 29. I got a quick precept. Okay. This is uh, Genesis chapter 25, verse 27. And the boy grew, and Esau was a cunning hunter, a man of the field, and Jacob was a plain man dwelling in tents. Going into your point about being upright, because the word plain really means perfect, morally right, morally correct, because he had lost. He was a morally right person, and that's Jake. They always want to do the right thing, it's in their conscience to do good. Right? Right? Oh, what is it? Do you remember 29? 29? 29? 29. Do you remember 29? 29, 29. We read. The secret, the secret things belongs unto the Lord Yahweh, our power. these things are secret. Even though we're on the highway the Bible is spilling it out, it's for our people, right? And, and when I hear offend our people, okay, the one third, two thirds will be offended because we say, yo, you can't be a mo and be a part of this, right? You can't, you can't be hitting niggas girl and be a part of this, mm -hmm. right? You can't be saying Jesus Christ and be a part of this. You can't be having AMPT, armpits, I, I got armpits. You, you know what I mean? And be a part of this, okay? Okay. Those things which are re revealed belongs unto us and, our, and to our children forever. Okay. And we are those children, man. It says forever. Okay? The spirit of prophets, it's, it's up to the prophets. All right? So th that's why the Pope, hey, we, we, many brothers, I tried to build it today. Um, and it's the Pope, he's bringing a busload of transgender <laughs> to have lunch. Mm -hmm. And uh, 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 I'm saying. I have some big balls men sitting out with, with, with wigs on and, and push up bra and, and a thick 
talking to him. Uh, right? With uh-huh. a straight face. Uh-huh. And you don't want to talk him. Right? So so we know here either that's a the false prophet. The brother put Shalom put a prophet in Revelation 19, 19 20. The false prophet, man. Alright? They have nothing to do with the Lord at all. Because if he was, he would say, hey, you know, still over there. And yeah. this is what it says right here. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And go. Mm-hmm. I mean, because like even if one come right here right right now, I couldn't I couldn't talk to him. I was, I was like, Listen, bro, name for you. Mm-hmm. You know, rude. You know, I'm not I'm no cordial, no cordial with him. Not in the mood, man. That's right. Disgusting. Mm-hmm. That's it. Is that we may do all the worst of his of this law. That's right. So we're gonna try our best because Esau's got us jacked up. Where even we wanted to, I know we weren't set up to do all the laws. The Bible says you can do all the laws. It says, man, the best of your ability, man. Mm-hmm. All right, so you don't, you don't sit up there and say, well, he says, you know, uh, the creature is subject to, subject to, to, to vanity. Yes, we are subject to, 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 to vanity, which means that we are going to go off, right? And any man says that he doesn't, sign out that nigga. You know what I mean? Like, nigga, you know what? You, you, you can't be a part of this. Mm-hmm. If you're perfect, go over here, man. But we ain't perfect. All right? The scripture is going to make us perfect. Like, when you that, that's what we're going to change. All right? We're going to do some, some, some off shit. And the most of us, uh, oh, oh, what is that? You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? And you just say, right? Yeah. I and mean, in your spirit, you know. You know when you do some some, some, some dumb ass shit. I mean, you, you, you say, girl, whatever, with a man. And because you're in the kingdom, you're like, you know, don't look too long. It looks so clean. Right? And you're easy to talk to the guy, so you know, but you should look good, though. You know what I'm saying? But you're know, going and say, yo, let's see if you move in there. I'm going to pass up my number. No, you say, you know what? But in the world, you would. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? You're great. good enough. Yeah, man. Some dumb ass shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. shit. Yeah. That's a man's girl, man. And you're nasty. You know, some man is digging out and you want to, like a pig watering in the mud. Mm. You know? That is homosexuality. Right? A lot of men don't know that. And because you jakes don't look at it like that, because you're so weak, you don't understand that you're actually committing homosexuality. To go behind another man, because like, like Esau brought out in his science, the sperm of a, of a man takes seven years to leave. If a man impregnates her, the sperm never leaves. And that's who you're putting your rod inside of. Mm-hmm. And you're supposed to be you're supposed to be a righteous vessel. Aren't you supposed to be a righteous vessel? So how are you going inside of a woman that's polluted? She's a polluted vessel. And I go into the Jeremiah 3. And when I think that goes into the oh, she she's really polluted. You know what they don't have that uh, Israel? Um, yeah, that was the point. Okay, right, cool. Yeah, yeah, that was the point. Unless you guys want more. No, I'm, I'm good with that. Yeah. Because that, that one goes all the way to the end. <laughs> that was powerful. Uh, First Maccabees 1 and 11. In those days, when there are the Israel, wicked men who persuaded men, saying, let us speak. It says, persuaded men. It's like, who persuaded many, saying, let us go and make a covenant with the heathen. They are around the bottles, for since we departed from, uh, from for since we Entertainment industry, like people in the whole NFL and football and soccer. They 
out they do all kinds of things for, like for, like for millions or millions of dollars. <laughs> you know what? I, I don't blame him. You know what? He has no faith. Hey, if you don't have faith in this truth, if you don't have faith in this world, right now, you do all kind of bugged up shit, man. Yeah, sure. Yeah. I, I, I need money, man. I get that. I, I, I need it. Sure. Right? Well, you got faith, Lord, you give that treasure, right, of faith. You see that, you know what? I'm good, man. I'm going to wait for the Lord, man. Uh, I'm all right. You know, I take my chances. Because the Lord, when you read the Bible, not one person that trusted the Lord that was left out, right? That was, that, that, that was left high and dry. Where are you taking chances in the world? Done. You're not taking a chance on the Lord, right? You're, you're taking a chance in the world, man. One little situation can get you caught up. That's it. And, and, and here is Jake's favorite scripture, Jake. Psalms 23. The Lord is my shepherd. You even know what it means, man. Right? It means he, he says, that, but though I walk in the valley of the shadow of death, this is where we at. This is a place where, you know, if you're out just walking, I'm going to brush you. Because he's, he's shooting at somebody else. Right? Because Jake can't shoot. Jake's like, when I see it now, I'm going to bust a shot in his head. You walk, you, you know, this, this, with your headphones on, these slippers, and, and, and get through a shot. But they can't shoot. You know what, Esau, Esau is a six year old, five year old, and, and, and they don't miss. It's like, cross here, put up. It's a five year old, yeah. Mm -hmm. Quick draw. Yeah, man. Oh, yeah. Yeah. What? This is Ecclesiastes 2 and 10. Look at the generations of old and see if ever any trusted in the Lord. And was confounded, or it, did any abide in fear? This requires reading, Jake. It says, look at a generation old. Don't go to what do you mean by that? It means you gotta read, man. Blessed is he that readeth. So the Lord is saying, look of all the patriarchs in the Bible that trusted in the Lord. Has any of them been left high and dry? Layman's term, new speak. That's what the Bible is saying. No! Right? The Lord's got their backs, man. Yeah, man, you drove. God. Job was one of the perfect examples, man. And Job was a righteous man, right? And and he had to go through all of that. So you have to say to yourself, I'm not Job. I was wicked as shit. And I'm going through this. Oh, I deserve this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I deserve this. They say in the world, I'll own it. You gotta own it, man. You gotta own it, man. Um, or did any abide in his fear and was forsaken? Or whom did he ever despise that call upon him? Well, Esau, I, I've seen some Edom, them, but oh, that's for you. God don't right? If you go back to Esau, Edom, it's in vain to call upon the Lord. All right? And really and truly, if a, a so-called white man is calling upon the Lord in our honesty and truth, most likely that ain't a white man. All right? So I always had to say, well, I'm going to reiterate, we're not this 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 vigilant crew that hate whites and, and blacks against whites because we understand that our people would look like the heathens, right? The Lord says, "My people are speckled birds." That's a trap. What you just said, God, 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 God. That's a that's a oh, he got you, God, that's a, God, right? You know, no such thing, man. Black and white, and, you know. That's a good job. This is my psalm in uh, 7 and 1. I myself also am a mortal man, like to all, that the offspring of him that was first made on the, of the earth. And in my mother's womb was fashioned, and in my mother's womb was fashioned to be flesh in the time of 10 months. So usually what we bring this priest about, and we try to uh, 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 um, showcase Yahweh Shai. Okay? That he was, a, he was a mortal man, right? He was born under the law, which means like, Lawfully, a man come to be with a woman, he could see in her and bring forth the child. After he says 10 months here, Esau says nine months, but I'm sure if you're going through it like properly, it will, it will be 10 months, right? But you know, Esau can't tell the truth. So even the lie a little bit, you know, he can't tell the truth. Mm -hmm. The numbers one and one, and the Lord spake unto Moses in the wilderness of Sinai, in the tabernacle of the congregation on the first day of the second month second year they were come up out of the land of Egypt saying take the, the sum of the of the congregation of the children of Israel after their fathers by the by the house of their fathers which the number of their of their names every male every male by their homes 
Hey, and let, let me tell you something. Your brother's not supposed to use the scriptures to join these arguments against man and woman and this and that. That's not the job of the scriptures. The job of the scriptures is to just let you know what your role is as a man. Mm -hmm. That's it. You have a certain way that you have to move and there's a certain way that the woman has to move. But before you can tell anybody how to move, you have to move like that first. So you just need to worry about uplifting yourself and understanding, oh, this is what, oh, I never knew this. I wasn't taught this. Yeah, we know you weren't taught this. You're learning this now. You're learning that you are a judge. You're learning that you are a man. You're learning that you are a, 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 you are a, a, a patriarch. You're learning that you are also a servant. Right? You're a servant of Yahweh Bashim Yom Shah. That's it. That's all you're doing first, man. You're not using these scriptures to go, well, you see, I'm the man, and this and that, and then you have to listen to me, woman. What? Relax, man. Relax. Go ahead. It says, take you to some of the, of the congregation of the children of Israel after their fathers, by the house of their fathers. It said, with the number of their home names, every male, every male by their home. So the other brother is reading that because what? We're in uh, Wisdom of Solomon, and it's telling you it's come back to the fashion of the law. So a man, right, impregnated Mary, that man was Joseph, okay, he had a father. And why do Christians always jump to Matthew's lineage and go to, go to 18? Start from the top, man. Stop skipping over, skipping over, all, over things, right? If you're in a rush, don't pick it up. Wait till you have some time, right? And you sit there, don't do it in 20 either. Right, because what are the, 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 the dress them on? He's all going to him. I'm not about you with this Bible. That's something that's this time, man. And just, and just, just you know, hold up a, a nice place and read the Bible. Cordially, you know, right? And it tells you the, the lineage, the father, and father, and father. And it says Joseph and Mary, who was the father of Yahweh. I said Jesus there, but it's, it should be Yahweh. Mm -hmm. It said, get the father, man. Any precepts? Hey, this is not a chill spot, eh? This is not a chill spot. This is not the block. We're not on the block. We're not selling drugs. Brothers are here to teach the word. Right. You got to be ready to teach the word. Go ahead. Yep. It says, these people are descended from the Chaldeans. And they shall turn here, uh, here to fall in Mesopotamia, because they did not follow the laws of the fathers, which were in the land of Chaldea. But they left the way of the ancestors. What scripture is that? Five five. You can break it down because it's hard to hear you all the way down here. Okay, I'm going to read it again, okay? Go ahead. So this is uh, Judah. Chapter 5, and you start at 6, brother? Come, come. Okay, so this is Judah, chapter 5, verse 6. It says here, This people are descended of the Chaldeans, and they sojourned here to four in Mesopotamia because they would not follow the gods of their fathers. And you know, Abraham, you know, which Abraham, his father was Terah, he was, his father was actually worshiping the gods of, 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 of the Egypt. Abraham, and Moses took Abraham out of uh, Chaldea and brought him out of, out of uh, Chaldea to, uh, to Canaan. So that's how the people became great uh, by the power of heaven, the power. Which were in the land of Chaldea, for they left the way of their ancestors and worshipped the power of heaven, the power of whom they knew, so they cast them out from the face of their powers. And they fled into Mesopotamia and sojourned their many days. Then their then their power commanded them to depart from the place where they sojourned and to go into the land of Canaan, where they dwelt. That's the word of the modern day Israel. That's how that. That's what the land is. 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 Where they dwelt, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Where they dwelt and were increased with gold and silver and with very much cattle. 
But when a famine covered all the land of Canaan, they went down into Egypt and sojourned there. That's what it was all about. People who went to Egypt, you know, it's been all like the famine was in Israel. And sojourned there while they flourished and became there a great multitude so that one could not number their nation. Yep. Okay, so this is a uh, verse. Therefore, the king of Egypt rose up against them and dealt suddenly with them and brought them low with laboring in brick and made them slaves. cast them out of their sight. And the Most High dried the Red Sea before them. And that's, that was our first accident. That was when the Most High said it's coming out of Egypt because we were in, we were in bondage, right? And so, like, the Most High was our power and through the expulsion, through, um, we are how we shy, we got delivered out of Egypt and we were brought into Israel. And the Most High dried the Red Sea before them and brought them to Mount Sinai. And Buddhists were first. Right? Power is given, not taken. And true power comes from Yahweh Bashim Yahushai. All right? Verse 11. Put on the whole armor of Yahweh. This is a part of it. So don't get part of this truth. Damn, I'm an Israelite. You know what I mean? I know the name. Okay, good. Because as the Lord said, many shall know my name. You may say, um, um, Yahweh Yahushai, I've prophesied in thy name. Right? But he said, get it, I didn't know you. So you might know the name. But that's not all. You have to put up the whole armament, and part of the armament is being brotherly. All right. The other brother just, just made a point. He said, "Hey, this ain't a block, right?" And and in, in some sense, I might say, "Yeah, like that, you know, you know, feel some kind of way." Brother, look, look at it for your welfare. If I, if, if if that was coming towards me, I'd say, "Yo, the water, brother, you know, and and, and put some 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 precepts and start my mind would be would be, be, be moving to the, to, to uh, accept the command." All right, so that's what this whole truth, this truth is about. It's about you get a crew and say, what? Well, boom, sure, right? And just by that, I see the brother like, yeah, it's, 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 it's fumbling, which is a good thing, okay? So the whole armor, all right? Verse 11, put on the whole armor of Yahweh that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil, right? To be deceived. So if you don't have this truth, you're gonna be deceived 100%, all right? You know, if, ands, or buts, if you're doing anything outside the script, the description in your downtime, right, and and put the Lord's the, the Lord's work aside, so you want to do what you want to do. Guess what? The most gonna leave, leave your ass out to dry. Mm -hmm. Better believe that. Verse twelve. For we, the men of the Lord, wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world. There's a wrestling going on, man. It started out when beginning. Esau and Jacob was wrestling in the room. It's a fight. Mm -hmm. A fight for what? What's right. And he's doing for what's wrong. He that's, loved to do what's wrong, man. That's what just happened when we started the camp. When we started the camp, that was good versus evil just now. Mm -hmm. They were evoking spirits of negativity, and we're now evoking spirits of righteousness. That's right. Okay. Um, against powers, against the rulers of darkness of this world, mm -hmm. against spiritual wickedness in high places. Mm -hmm. Wherefore, Take unto you. See, it's, it's working right now on my phone. Yeah. Wherefore, take unto you the whole armor of Yahweh, that ye may be able to withstand in the evil day. Mm -hmm. And the evil day, we always bring it out, mm -hmm. okay, is a day, Isaiah 13, a day of darkness, a day of wrath, a day of, 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 of justice, man. All right? That's what we're, what we're doing it for. We want to be exempted. A war is started. Is that like it, 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 we had rumors of war? It's going on. It's been going on, man. It's been going on. Doesn't he? Doesn't spill over to, to here yet? 
You see the people in, in Palestine feeling it right now? Are they waiting? The man says, we're calling truth of four days. And in four days, you know, it'll terrify you. You'll be, you'll be four days again? <laughs> this shit again? Four days. They say, in about a year, four days, they get some gas. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, there's a bottle of water. He let, he let it up. 137 trucks of, of like supplies. You know, look at this, man. Mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't want the water, man. I'm cool, man, because I want to die anyway. You know, what's your water for? <laughs> right? I got peanut butter. Wait, 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 wait. You're going to die. Right? So this is a, this is what we're, we're trying to like not have to deal with. All right? So we stand in the evil day and having done all to stand. Stand, therefore, having your loins girt about with truth. Mm -hmm. Not a damn Freemason rag around, around your balls, man. With truth. This is a place that's shrouded in lies and wickedness, and the only thing that can get us free is the truth. Yahashai says what? The truth shall make us free. That's, that's right. right. Okay? Um, and having on the breastplate of righteousness. So is it a literal breastplate that says righteousness on it? No, dumb dumb. It's the whole book, man. The scriptures. This is a breastplate of righteousness. Mm -hmm. All right? Not some damn pedophile book, some damn porno um, a book on your mattress they whack fine. off to first uh, yeah, but it's true because look at look how much of them durham police just caught God. <laughs> the durham police yeah something like that yeah durham police just and it's so funny that's how you know durham police is a part of pedophiles because why would you expose it if you're catching so much don't tell nobody God. keep catching them God. why would you expose it now exactly. they know exactly right <laughs> when you guys are about to go in in the hood after project kill a nigga or project clean up drugs you don't put it on social media right. you just go in the hood three four o'clock in the morning kick down their door and tell them to get on the fucking floor that's it so if you're catching pedophiles why would you inform them that you're catching them in that way you're, you're not supposed to tell them you're supposed to keep it a secret man <laughs> keep arresting them right. that was a good thing and then you exposed it um, they're just like damn this is doing a good job Shit. Verse, that was my favorite show. The Chris Hansen, I didn't catch a pedophile, but they had to cut it off because remember, they were catching the Pazars. Like, yeah. Last, last one was, uh, he was a serious guy. Rabbi. He was a crown prosecutor or something. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's like, turn it off right now. Turn it off right now. I'm not going to believe it. I said, what? No, that was a great show, man. And just, just, just Google um, uh, um, pedophiles or child sex rings and go to the news. A lot of them. Two days ago, three days ago, last week. It's a bunch of them. You know, and this is not, not being reported. This place is sickening, man. All right. Verse 15, and your feet shod with the preparation of the gospel of peace. We're pushing peace, man. This is a peaceful... Uh, 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 um, congregation. That's right. All right, and we're talking peace to our people. That's right. We're, we're the one that's called the peaceful because you say, brother, you're armed up, right? Talk about uh, you know, uh, like uh, I, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a good boxer, you know. My, my punches are hard. No, we're saying we know the scriptures. That's what our, our message. We know the scriptures. Okay. Oh. Taking the shield of faith. See that? So faith is what's going to shield us. Faith in what? Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai. That's a treasure. Okay? We treasure the fact that the Lord has extended us faith. Not the literal mountains, these government men. Right. Right? Put Esau down. <clears throat> Our faith is that the Lord is going to come back and another system be gone. God, <laughs> looking at it <laughs> like, like Neo, like Neo. Bend, bend the spoon. We got you're not bending the spoon, you're bending your mind. All right, go ahead. All right. Um, wherewith <laughs> you shall be able to quench all the fire darts of the wicked. You know, them, them, them Israelites, you know, you know they're, 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 they're terrorists. Mm -hmm. I mean, they hurt small hatters. You know, they're, they're, none of that. Mm -hmm. That's all lies. Like a lot of us have our friends that are small headers. You know what I mean? I was like, yo, what's up? And, and, if, and if it comes down to it, we'll tell them what, what the truth is. Guess what? 
why is it a serpent and the harmless is a dove? Mm -hmm. Right? And I hear that affect anything they're doing our work. Like if you work at KFC fried chicken, when well, you leave it on go out to fried chicken from everybody you see, your job is frying chicken at KFC. You put burgers at work at Wendy's, you don't go, hey man, I'm working at Wendy's, come for the other burger on the fridge. Nah, that's what I do at Wendy's. So this is what we do for our work and we have our, our daily life, right? But we don't bring our daily life in the, the, the world. There's no part Our daily life is with the brothers, brotherhood, we know are the one man we believe in. You all guys will be against what we, what we believe. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the most I want is fruit, meat for repentance. That's it. You don't give this to everybody. That's it. You have to know what you're doing, man. Right? You don't cast your pearls before God, sign, God, God, right? God. You have to be very careful of, of how you promote this. God. You promote this in a, in a righteous <clears> way. It's like when you start a business, they ask you, what's your core audience? Well, we have a core audience, and this is a business, mm -hmm. right? Our core audience are the men, right, that are on the sign. Mm -hmm. And then through those men on the side, we're gonna see how you are, man. Because some some fell on stony ground, mm -hmm. some fell on good ground. Some, you're you're gonna know. I do water, brother. Yeah. You're gonna know. Right. 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 Ephesians 1 and 17 and it reads that the power of our Lord Yahweh, while Yahweh Shai, the Father of glory, may give unto you the spirit of wisdom. Hey, because when you're dealing with people, you might drop nuggets, mm -hmm. just a little, mm -hmm. just to see where their mind is at. Because you might have a friend in the world, and mm -hmm. he's cool, he's a uh, nigga, who yeah. knows what he does, it doesn't matter what he does. Could be a damn drug dealer, who cares? Mm -hmm. And you might drop him a nugget, just to see how he reacts. Mm -hmm. If he reacts negatively, you'll never drop him another nugget again. That's it. That's, it's not for him. Go find your own nugget, mm -hmm. right? And then if you ever come to me and say, hey, you ever seen this? Yeah. Then I might reason with you, but I'll never bring nothing to you again. <clears throat> Right. may give out to you the spirit of wisdom and revelation in the knowledge of him now one of the revelations is reading people mm -hmm. you don't know how to read people why do you think amalek is so good mm -hmm. amalek is good at reading people on the left hand side mm -hmm. you have to be good at reading people on the right hand side you don't feel people's uh energy right a lot of you brothers you question your own inner man don't you know you have an inner man mm -hmm. don't you know your outer man or your carnal self oppresses the spiritual man you have to trust the inner man the inner man is the righteous man mm -hmm. he's the one that's guiding you in the right way it's your carnal self that's holding that man back he wants you to do good the inner man mm -hmm. right so you got to listen to that inner man sometimes sometimes that inner man tells you hey don't do this don't do that mm -hmm. and you're like oh shit. you know if God. i went out I would have got myself in trouble. That's that inner man. That's right. That inner man is warning me, huh? Verse 18. The eyes of your understanding being enlightened, that you may know what is the hope of his calling and what is the riches of the glory of his inheritance in the saints. And what, verse 19 is like here. And what is the exceeding greatness of his power to us who are to believe according to the work of his mighty power? Right, so going into that, doing this, doing the lessons, right, watching the apostles, the elders, that's how we get wisdom and understanding of this, right? Which time is short, right? Malachi 3, verse 16, that they that feared the Lord Yahweh spake often one to another, and the Lord Yahweh hearkened and heard it, and a book of remembrance was written before him. For them that fear the Lord Yahweh and that thought upon his name. So you see, he says one to another. That's via these, these videos, man. Mm -hmm. You see, when a brother put a put, put a, a scripture on your live, that's that, that's us in the spirit, right? Using the, the words of the Father. Mm -hmm. right? Breaking bread. God, I'm breaking bread. Mm -hmm. Alright? Like uh, if you go on IOIC comment board, yeah. which is it hurts. Oh, bullshit. <laughs> bullshit. Armpit, 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 armpit. armpit. Right? That's what I see. You know? Oh, you admit you're the greatest. Go, go, go on, Bishop. Exactly. <laughs> it's ma man worship. Exactly. You know? He's bringing Israel to righteousness. Okay, God. Man. God. 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 Okay. On the horse. Yeah. Yeah, I wish I purple, man. Please. And they shall be mine, saith the Lord Yahweh of hosts. In that day, 
when I make up my jewels, and I will spirit them as a man spirit his own son that serveth him. Then shall ye return and discern between the righteous and the wicked. Right. So, so this is what's gonna make you know who's righteous and who's wicked. It's wicked when you know you come here to get cleaned up, you pretend you got the word, right? You said shalom and you leave and you call a ray ray and say, Ray Ray, you got that thing for me? Right? And that, that thing is, is some kind of drug paraphernalia then. Or yo, I'm gonna tell you that thing when we, you know, we went to that jerk chicken, jerk chicken place, that bad thing with it, call her over, man. You know she got a man, right? You talk about yo, the, the man up on the turf floor says, jam him. You know what I'm saying? We don't do those things, man. We, we, you know, we're about the book. We're about the Haba Shim Yal Shai. Mm -hmm. That's all in our mind. And occasionally, you know, Big Booty Judy, you know, occasionally. But first and foremost, it's Yahweh Ba Shim Yahweh Shai. Right. Mm -hmm. Right, brother? Between him that serveth power and him that serveth him not. So there's so a the difference. You know, you have, you have one that's going to subscribe to the truth. <clears throat> I wonder what, <coughs> right? Is this or that? And even about I'm in the middle. There's no such thing. Mm -hmm. The Lord don't like lukewarm, man. You go buy a coffee and expect it to be hot, and it's going to spit it out, right? You buy a soda and it's hot. I want a soda, man. It's warm. I want, I want a cold soda, man. Right? So the Lord is saying, listen, man. No lukewarm spirit. Oh, oh, God. oh man. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> You know, but hey man, change this. It's too, you know, change. I didn't want it no more. I'm good. <laughs> you, know, you want something else? I don't want to get my money back. Else. You don't want, want your money back. It's vex. I don't want my money back. I'm good. <laughs> Proverbs, start the Proverbs five and one. My son, attend unto wisdom and and bow and bow thine ears to my understanding. That means give 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 give, give worship, give praise, man. Bow your ears, mm -hmm. right? Come humble. What the Lord say? What the Lord say? Right, more you watch your videos, the apostles is talking, and you see this. Hey, hey! Thing is on, man. Go in your room. Mm -hmm. Go play him a game. Go play your game. You know what I'm saying? There's something to distract him. Mm -hmm. You know? Because this is what you want to hear. You can buy your ear. Right, it's honey cold. God, that, sweet. This is that thou mayest regard. That thou mayest regard discretion, and that thy lips. May keep knowledge. That's right. So you live keep knowledge by getting this word, you know. Uh, I'm watching the apostles. But those are some wise men. Mm -hmm. Right? Those are some wise men. Uh, like I said before, I said again, like I was apostles higher ago. Is he gonna mess up? You know, is he gonna say something wrong? Mm -hmm. You know? I, I haven't seen maybe me, brother, I haven't really seen him mess. I don't, I don't remember him doing that. All right, or in any of the apostles. Like so sometimes the apostle would say something, not mess up, but, but, but the apostle can't, hey, but, yeah, and then, like, oh yes, apostle, you know, correct him right there and then. That's it. But the, the, those are wise men, that, you know, the, 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 that, that's, the, that's the real elders, man. Real wise men. Yeah, I was watching the elder Tahar, right? Apostle Tahar, he was, he was watching the, I think the Curly, I think the, the uh, Shirley Church, Show. The Church, 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 yeah. Show. Uh, yeah. I was caught up the small hats. But, no, oh, and, and sure. like I just said, like, you know, as to who we are, yeah. and that they're going to sleep. Yeah, that's it. And, and that's it. Straight up. Right. No, like, you're getting a sugar coat. Yeah. Right? And it was a simple joke talking about, oh, you love everybody. Burn your ass up, right? Never get it forgiven again. Forget it. Forget it. Forget it. Forget it. it is simple, man. And probably in that Jake. Like, remember, it goes both ways. Not all, not, not all so called black men is an Israelite man. Right, some of them, some of them is Esau. Tears. There's a lot of tears. You know what I mean? Coco, you the way. God. You can see spirits, man. Mm -hmm. So you, you, you might look at an Israelite. That's mm -hmm. right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Shoot your mouth up. Strange woman drops as honeycomb and her mouth is smoother than oil. Oh, Islam sounds nice, bro. When you're searching for something to belong to, you're bound down there, yeah. you know? H-O-I, you're know, saluting, you're your, your face shining with a Vaseline on it, you know? With, with the paper, you know, brother, brother, you know, pot. Looks Kim good, it. looks good, Kim yeah, it, you know? Jigs, a lot of jigs going there. Yeah. <laughs> they're, they're like, I, oh, I chose between that and Christianity, because so Christianity looks weak right now. Like, Pastor, a lot of them, too, 
like they or uh, like they know that um that a man can have more than one Islam, right? So like so like that's why they're not living in Madrid and practicing that Islam. And a lot of them got protection in jail. Yes. 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 You got the that that Freemason doctrine, you know, hand signs, you know, El Cote with, with his with his pants one rolled up, you know, they would have looked up. You know? And, and, and they would take rod part out. Mm -hmm. Listen, look at Jay-Z, um, Puffy, all of them. They're all fucking billionaires, but they have to do a lot of things. Mm -hmm. What leap on that? Casting couch. If you, he was like 10 years old or 12 or something. And Bieber was 10 years old. Yeah, yeah Bieber was. Yeah. Right? Yeah. 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 Orlando. Yeah, the Oshkosh. Oh. The Oshkosh, what's that? Puffy? He's like, yeah. He has flashed that shit. Flash 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 I was like, what the fuck is this? Puffy, give me the Oshkosh, what's that? And lift his lips. Meat meal and shit, man. Like, you saw that video with meat meal, like, in the top. Yeah. You know? Man. Man. Yeah. Man, that's disgusting. For her lip of their mouth is smoother than oil, but her end is bitter and wor and wormwood. That's right. So if you ain't subscribed to this truth, right, the most I can give you uh, uh, your, uh, your share, your fair share, right, he called you into this ministry. Guess what, man? The end, the end is what destruction. Yeah, yeah that's because because that honeycomb is Luciferianism, and Luciferianism, when they broke it down to the uh, compound, is what do as thou wilt. And that sounds nasty, great. Nasty. That actually really sounds good. Could you imagine when Eve heard that? Eve's just like, what? I could don't do have whatever. to listen to Adam? I can do whatever I want. So it sounds good, but then it leads to destruction. Mm -hmm. right? Destruction. I paid two million dollars to twerk. I mean, really? Mm -hmm. Yeah, two million dollars. Right? You twerk all you want. Twerk off. Twerk it off. Hey, you, you know what promoted that really well? There's a back in the day movie called A Decent Proposal, Indecent where, where a guy offered them money to sleep with a man's wife, yeah. mm -hmm. and then they're just they thought about it, da, 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 and then they end up doing it, and then it completely destroyed the marriage mm -hmm. because you can't have that, man. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can't have that, man. and that guy was a representation of a serpent, man. The guy who offered the money, man. Yeah. But her end is bitter as wormwood, sharper as a as two-edged sword. Her feet, her feet go down to death, and her steps take hold on on hell. Less says nothing. Less thou shouldest less thou shouldest ponder the past of life. Her ways are her ways are movable. That thou means canst not find something. That thou, that thou canst not know them. Hey, because when you open a door, right, or a portal, it's hard to close it back. So that's what Esau has done. He has opened opened the door for demons, and more demons just keep coming through that fucking door, mm -hmm. right? So he opened the door to homosexuality, and look what's coming through. And the last thing to come through that door is going to be pedophilia. Mm -hmm. And then that's when you people are going to be like, no, 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 close the door, close the door. Mm -hmm. No, I just wanted to be a lesbian. No, I just wanted to be a, 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 a tranny. I, I didn't want this. No, you fucking retards. You open the door. Mm -hmm. That's why the door needs to stay shut. See that? Say the spirit? Okay. Two men. Oh, gosh. The Proverbs one and four. It said to some. It, it, it said to give some will. It's not to give some. Will, to give some. To give some. To, 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 to give some.
tilted to the simples and to the young man knowledge and, and like like an expression, a wise man will hear. Yeah, because guess what? At the end of the day, you people on the side, you're judges. But how are you gonna be a judge with no knowledge? You need the knowledge to actually jump, judge uprightly. This is how you judge uprightly. It's like when you guys get into the back and forth with these women, and the women will say, oh, well, if you can have more than one woman, I can have more than one man. Well, no, you can't. Yeah. The reason why yeah. I can have more than one woman is because of A, B, C, and D. That's mm -hmm. righteous judgment. Mm -hmm. What a woman having more than one man, what does that do? That opens a door. Yeah. And trust me, you don't want to have that door open. This It's going to lead to, 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 to degenerate behavior. Mm -hmm. It's going to lead to worse, worse, worse. Because guess what? Imagine you live in a home and a woman has three men. You're going to see another man naked, right? You're never going to know whose child that is. <laughs> that's that's just unrighteousness, mm -hmm. right? It's unrighteousness compounded, compounded, compounded to where now you two men are so, are so feminized that you might start popping each other. Because yeah. you become Almost so damn feminine, this. right? Yeah. That's how these jakes they go off with the living in the world. Mm -hmm. They'll have three, four women, but then the woman will start getting on. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's right. Yeah. That's right. That's right. Which is all these women, all the society, right? A lot of these women, they, they're grown up in the society to be a temple prostitute. Mm -hmm. Just like yeah, in the ancient world, that's how they started off. Yeah. Temple prostitute, yeah. prostitute for six months, a year at the, at, the, at the temple, and then you move up in the occult. <laughs> and that's how they are in this society, right? You know? Sorry, they saw young. Hey, and that, that goes to um, what's her name? I, I can't remember which god, but I think it's Venus. Because they would the, the, the strippers they would dance around the pole and the pole is just the penis of Osiris. Yeah. And then you would you would off you would give them an offering. And that's what that money is. Mm -hmm. That money is just an offering. Yeah, it goes back to the main pole as well. That's why people dance around the main pole. That's what they were doing a couple weeks ago for Halloween. Mm -hmm. But that's the same, and now we, we offer money, we mm -hmm. offer dollar bills. Mm -hmm. But that that's that's to the mother goddess, man. Mm -hmm. That's to the mother goddess Venus. So said to give subtility, to give subtility to the simple, to the young man knowledge, and like it's like to the not to the young man knowledge and discretion. Yeah. See now the now what you just taught, what the elder just taught, just gave you knowledge and discretion. Oh shoot, then I shouldn't do that. Mm -hmm. When you're in the world, you don't know, right? Like, you, you have this guy, uh, his name is Papoose. Him and his daughter went to a strip club. What the heck? Why would you bring your daughter, daughter. to the strip club? Gun. But that's the rights of this world. Mm -hmm. Oh, your daughter just turned 21? Gotta bring her to the club. Gotta bring her here. Gotta do this. This, mm -hmm. this is the stuff you guys are doing with your daughter. What? That's from the stripper. Yeah. yeah. How did you know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, so in true essence, right? If you go to the strip club and you're there just doing money and doing partaking in anything, that's pretty much you're a faggot, pretty much. That's some gay shit. Well, it's it's a it's a it's a worship of the mother goddess. It, it's not really homosexuality. It's more of a mother goddess worship. Well, because like, you're, you're around a bunch of other dudes, right? Mm. They're all drunk. They're high. They're smoking. Everybody's hot. They look like women. Like, if you're sitting around men that are hard like that, it just shows like you're fucked up too. Whether you're not, whether you may, you may think you're straight, but like that's a whole other thing too. No, I'm just saying. Yeah. It's basically yeah. like the, like the brother said, it's a temple again, right? It's a temple harlot. That's all she is. Yeah, yeah. 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 harlot. Temple. Yeah. 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 <laughs> That's we're, not, we're not gonna have a ship from the kids. No, right. no, no, not at all. Not at all. <laughs> we're gonna have our wives. We're gonna have our wives. Yeah, God. <laughs> yeah. 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 With, with, yeah, exactly. In righteousness. Righteous wives. Hey, that's where that's where the, a lot of eunuchs were born. Especially when you go back to um, you uh, always. Medieval times. No, not in medieval time. Where you always talking about uh, um, the Arabs. Oh. Yeah, the, the yeah, Arabs. The, harems. the, the harems. Oh. They had. Harems. That was our people. And you weren't allowed to be a man around the woman unless you were, you, uh, you, like, do out of unless you were castrated. Yeah. Yeah. It's a drag racer. Yeah. 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 A wise man will hear and will increase learning, mm -hmm. and a man of understanding shall attend unto wise counsel. 
to understand a proper. <coughs> that's why I say, remember that, remember that thing in 2000, oh, oh, hell yeah. That's the spirit, man. Mm -hmm. Right? And there's high level people, billionaires that are into that. Oh, yeah. and they, some spirit they spit in each other's yeah. body. They spit so, it back. And that goes back to Bob. That goes back to Bob. That goes back to Bob Fewer because you have to go on the mountain. You have to actually take a shit right there, man. That's an offering. Yeah. Hey, they had an idol there. You had to And then you had to eat it. In the 90s, they were big with the horse. So women yeah, would lay with horses. Temple for yep, that's right. This before, as I live, said the Lord of Israel, surely Moab shall be as Sodom and the children of Ammon as Gomorrah. Mm -hmm. You just saw the Moabite Sodomite, that one mm -hmm. with the Edomite, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because I, I saw a video too that they have. Um, <laughs> <laughs> like a, like basically it's, it's like shit and, and it's like uh, like a uh, like a beat. Like, yeah, it's a shit yeah, it's like a yeah, it's basically. Right? And yeah. like and they make it like they actually like low I, I think I mean they'll have the the cocks. Yeah. Oh, they have it for the the, the, the springtime. Yeah. In the spring that that's their springtime like celebration. Yeah. Freaky. Uh, Go, hold on, go up here, go on floor, right? There's a shit. There's a, there's a shit, like a, like, what is it, a toy or doll or whatever it is. The kids go there and look at it. It's an ice, ice cream spot. Yeah, it's an ice cream spot. Yeah. It's a bowl, right? Yeah. It's like a caricature. I saw it. Like they have a whole bunch of dogs. Like it, what the like fuck? It, it, I mean, go into the warehouse and smell like dogs. Yeah, right. How does it smell like In case someone got hungry, you know? Yeah, this is first Kings eleven and one. Together with the daughter of Pharaoh and women of the Moabites. That's not the Moabites are good, man. You know what I mean? What? Especially the ones that are born in this life. You know, because they're not And they're very smart. I like Elon. And have. <laughs> Look at this. Because we haven't really traveled. Let's, let's not forget That's true. Right. No, you're right. You're right. True. You're right, brother. You're right. He's right. right. He's right. Because right. the passport, right. 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 bro. Oh, you're right. The passport, bro. It's going all over the world, bro. Oh, shit. Yo, yo. I got one of them for the Japan, man. It's a kick, though. No, you're right. That's it. Those Ammonites have They'll some good teams, you. you're right. Bring yeah. her to me. Yeah, I want to go there too. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey and there. even even in the even in the, the the shows that they have, they'll have them where you just go and wearing something nice huh. and you just get to choose. Yes. Choose. Yes. 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 Yeah, yeah right. that's well. a good example. <laughs> no, you're right. That's yeah. right. China. <laughs> mm. China, China, China's like that. It's illegal to try to to see what you're doing. But, 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 um, hey, don't get, don't, say, and they know, but you can't say, I want to, you know, don't, don't go to Thailand. <laughs> more low, more low. I'm telling you, you might get a man, you know, <laughs> <laughs> time, man. Uh, I can't, I can't, yeah. Uh, second Timothy 3 and uh, 16, they read all the scriptures is given by inspiration of Yahweh and is preferable for doctrine, for reproof, for correction. For instruction in righteousness. Verse 17. That the man of Yahweh may be perfect, throughout and furnished unto all good works. Yeah, that's what he was, that's what that's what Adam was going through. 
right? When Adam was was um, was with the Most High, that's mm -hmm. what he was going through. He was going through the lessons Done. of how he was going to be a judge, Done. how he was he was going to rule over the animals, mm -hmm. which means that that's how he was going to rule over the earth, mm -hmm. right? And then rule over the other nations, right? Mm -hmm. But he had to learn how to rule over himself mm -hmm. first, right? Which he failed at, mm -hmm. as he forgot that he was a, he was a man and followed the woman. Yeah, in this society, you try to be perfect. Because you used to be at one point, you used to be different. And people look at you now, well, why, why are you more like that? Why, why, why you change? Yeah, you have to now. change. Yeah. Yeah. You can't be the same person. And now you have to hold yourself yes. accountable more. Yeah. Right? Like you're not you're not just out here to judge people. Mm -hmm. They forget that, hey, I'm judging myself too. So I have to separate myself. That's right. Don't get it twisted. Mm -hmm. You know, like let's say your family invited you over here to the United States mm -hmm. uh, uh, for your Thanksgiving. You went over there. Now, you have to say to yourself, do I really want to go? Mm. That's a judgment call that you have to make as a man of the Lord to be like, man, like I know it's just chilling with family, but do I want to go? It's a judgment call. Mm -hmm. And it's a judgment that you're going to have to live with, man, mm -hmm. to know that am I going to mix and mingle around these people? Mm -hmm. These are all judgments yeah. that you have to make as a king. That's right. Because your kingdom starts right now. Right, right now with how you're moving. And the, th the decisions that you're making, the decisions we make right now, can either either uh, uh, get us a uh, uh, good judgment or bad judgment, man. This is uh, Second Ezra 15 and 46. It says, "And thou Asia, that art partaker of the hope of Babylon, and art the glory of her person, woe be unto thee, thou wretch." Moab, Ammon, right? All these different lands in the East, Oriental, and the Japanese, Egypt, Thailand, Vietnam. They do weird, freaky things over here. Right. Right. I'm not big into that. Okay, a lot of different Koreans, they can't see. It's like a sin for them to be in the summer. So a lot of them can see. They have to shit. Yeah, they have the visor. Yeah, they have the hat umbrella. You know what they think, you know? They're in that shit of what? If you're skin, I don't know. Oh, and they used to be dark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They used to be dark. Look at the, look at the, 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 the people from the, the, the different islands that are around them. Look how dark a lot of them are. The people from Thailand and all those different places. Those people are dark. Man. Cambodia. Cambodia is another one. Philippines. Yeah, the Philippines. Yeah. So they're putting all that pigeon shit on their face, too, right? says, uh, Woe be unto thee, thou wretch, because thou hast made thyself like unto her, and hast decked thy daughters in order, that they might please and glory in thy lovers, which have always desired to commit order with thee. Thou hast followed her, and that is made in all her works, and inventions. Hey, and that's a bad thing for the Moabites and Ammonites now in this society. But in the kingdom, it's going to be the same thing onto us. They're going to be subservient. They're just a subservient people. They're a whole nation of subservient type of people. So when we're back in rulership, that's how subservient they're going to be onto us as well, man. Right? right. That's, that's why in the kingdom it says they're going to be a wash pot. What is that? It's just a servant, man. You're going to give them whatever, whatever you like. <laughs> It's like the, uh, the guy in Japan is going around asking women, Japanese women, about what do you think about your fantasy you know, the majority, 80 percent, they said it's fine. He said, you know, a man needs something. They're all like 25 and 30 years old. Nice, young, yeah. good looking Very feminine. Like, how do you speak to when you hear him talking? Yeah. Because you have a drink that's all over Japan. And they're, they're not speaking, coming back. Uh, they're speaking <laughs> Japanese now. Yeah. Them off. And they're not coming back. They're, they're chilling over there. Yeah. <laughs> uh, thou hast followed her that is hated in all her works and inventions. Therefore, saith Yahweh, I will set place upon thee widowhood, poverty, famine sword pestilence to waste thy houses with destruction and death this is second, second Thessalonians chapter verse 6 it says 
have to know that there's a difference right between the, the the curses that we're putting up like when we're calling down curses or we're calling on the most high to send back his only begotten but we're also charging this society that it's just done right because there's charge we're charging you right red free Nope, you're not supposed to do that. Nope. Why your sins have reached onto the clouds and why you're going to be destroyed. So when you're in that flame, when you're in that million degree heat and your, your eye socket and your tongue <laughs> is consuming away, you're going to be like, oh yeah, I was getting popped. Uh -huh. I bent over. Sins, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, con, con. That yeah, that's right, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. A wicked brother. That if any would not work, we should be eaten. For we hear that there are some which walk among you disorderly. That's right. Mm. Under, right. That, under that disguise of, of a brother. Of us, as a brother. You know? Yeah. There was a guy in Trinidad years ago, some brothers remember him. Yeah, he yeah. He put himself yeah. in a damn drop case, man. <laughs> trying to repent. But the Lord kicked him out, man. You know? Because he was asking brothers for money, man. And then a lot of times you got to see can you work it out? Can you actually do something? Exactly. Are you even working? Mm. Exactly. Right? That's what Paul's talking about. Right. Verse 12. Now, them that or the are one such... guy he slept with a brother's woman or something like that. Ex There's no such thing, but Iron, Iron. yeah, God. But that's what he was claiming. He was claiming, yeah. He 
serving again and it, everywhere we turn we're just servants man that's all that you are because you 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 as a watchman you're not the owner of these men mm -hmm. but you're the watchman you're watching mm -hmm. over their souls mm -hmm. nor uh, give us him not warning nor speaketh to warn the wicked from his wicked way to save his life the same wicked man shall die in his iniquity mm -hmm. but his blood will i require at thine hand mm -hmm. Yet if thou warn the wicked, and he turn not from his wickedness, mm -hmm. nor from his wicked way, he shall die in his iniquity, but thou hast delivered thy soul. Hey, that's why the, um, the, 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 uh, the internet is such an important tool to water Yahweh Hashem Yahweh for that, because mm -hmm. the word has to go throughout the four corners of the earth, and without the Urim and the Durm, it would be damn near impossible for us, because look what happened during two mm -hmm. years ago yeah. we weren't even able to move mm -hmm. Esau locked down the whole globe now he's created 15 minute cities <laughs> you won't even be able to go to Brampton <laughs> you won't even be able to go to Scarborough <laughs> you're going to be stuck in the great wherever you are located mm -hmm. <laughs> so Barak the Yah for the right. internet and the word the word has gotten throughout uh, the four corners of the earth right? again when a righteous man returned from his righteousness commit iniquity and I lay a stumbling block before him, he shall die because thou hast not given him warning. He shall die in his sin and, and his righteousness. That's why we're 24-7 we're at the broken record on this subject. <laughs> on the M-A-R-K. So in that time, when you, when you take it, when a lot of you bozos take it, you just sit there and take it and you're like, shit, can I take this? Shit. <laughs> you know? Hey. Like, yeah, like, like, yeah. M-A-R-K, <laughs> chapter 6, verse 66. <laughs> our, our family, our, our, our family, our cousins, our friends, you know, they're like, yeah, you see, mm -hmm. it's happening, but, it, but I get it. Okay. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Hey, because remember, the majority of people in this society, they live off of image, so they have to keep up with um, the image. Yeah. Yep. Yes, they yes. can't, they can't present themselves mm -hmm as impoverished that's why they that's why they call us what they call us right mm -hmm. what do they bumalites yeah bumalites <laughs> okay cool cool man it says he shall die in his sin and hey when you when you brothers see some people who are going to be in them in them concentration camps mm -hmm. or some people who are going to be living in tents you're going to be like what the hell i just saw you on instagram mm -hmm. yeah. don't you have a million followers what happens that's <laughs> good. You guys should watch the season two, man. That's what. That's right, man. Right now. That's right. The whole is fine. The lineup. That's right. He shall die in his sin, and his righteousness, which he hath done, shall not be remembered. But his blood will I require at thine hand. Mm -hmm. Nevertheless, if thou warn the righteous man, and the righteous sin not, and he doth not sin, he shall surely live, because he is warned. Also thou hast delivered thy soul. Mm -hmm. And the hand of Yahweh was, was there upon me, and he said, I'm Hey, and that's how you know, make Satan, I'm sorry, 
he's an unrighteous man, mm -hmm. right? I don't want to hear no, like, that's cool. If you have the opinion that he can repent and all of that, I don't think he can because now you're teaching people right. that the M-A-R-K is not what it is. Mm -hmm. That's weird to me, man. Mm -hmm. That's weird, man. That's off, man. That's an off spirit. You could love money all you want. You could yeah. be this, you could be that. Mm -hmm. But now you're literally leading all those flocks of people to the slaughter. Yeah. Right to the slaughter. Mm -hmm. the slaughter. He says, a wise judge will instruct his people. That's right. And the government of a prudent man is well ordered. Hey, and you know what the thing is? You know, you know why a lot of people can't come to this truth? Because being a judge is a lonely life. And a lot of people don't like to be lonely. A lot of people don't know how to uh, uh, take themselves away. Right? A lot of people are dependent on people, man. <laughs> to be a part of this, you have to know how to be alone. So and, not, and not be alone mm -hmm. in a way where you're 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 lowering yourself. Mm -hmm. You have to learn how to be alone to where you're actually doing something with your alone time. Mm -hmm. How did you better yourself? Mm -hmm. Like me. I used to love uh, kung fu movies and stuff. And then the guy he would suffer a defeat and then he would leave and go somewhere far off and just seclude himself. And mm -hmm. then by the time he came back, he came back better, mm -hmm. more efficient. Mm -hmm. So when you seclude yourself, you're supposed to seclude yourself to become more efficient. You're supposed to become better. People are supposed to see your advancement to be like, damn, that brother's putting in work. Good. Shit. Yeah. Two, as the judge of the people is himself. That's right. And the judge, the, these judges are Luciferians. Mm -hmm. So that's why you see these people turn into Luciferianism mm -hmm. in whatever shape or form, whether okay. it's witchcraft, whether it's homosexuality, whether it's pedophilia, mm -hmm. whether it's transgenderism, because what's transgenderism? Transgenderism is the worship of Baphomet. Do you know who Baphomet is? Baphomet is the god of this world. That is the horn deity. He has breath. And he has a phallus, right? So he is a transgender. So that's why transgenderism is being pushed because it's a form of, of um, enlightenment. Mm -hmm. They feel like a transgender is 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 above a man. Mm -hmm. They believe, yeah, 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 that, that's a man and a woman coming together. That's the feminine and the masculine joining forces. So they feel like that's the more powerful man, mm -hmm. right? Just like they used to tell me when I was growing up during the during the 90s when I was growing up, they taught men how to be what? Metrosexual. Mm -hmm. That's a Baphomet. The spirit of Baphomet. Because they told you men that you're too masculine. You need to be more mm -hmm. feminine. Yeah. That's transgenderism mm -hmm. spiritually, man. Right. They want to get you spiritually. Mm -hmm. They change the black man spiritually. The black man, you're too soft. That's right. You're supposed to be a ruler. This world is yours to rule right. and govern. That's right. But you're too damn soft, man. Right. Go ahead. As the judge of the people is himself, so are his officers, and what manner of man the ruler of the city is. Um, what's his name? The mayor of Toronto. The crack smoking mayor. Right? Mm. A lot of people in, in Canada and Toronto, whatever, they turn to drugs, man. Fentanyl, right? Uh -huh. mites are crashing out now. Fuck the mites anyway. Alphabet lifestyle. Right? That's right. Because you have these guys in the NBA, these big, tall, six foot, seven foot guys. That guy's getting pop. That's right. And that kind of pop up with niggas in, in, the, in the NBA. What's his name? Dwight Howard. The White Howard. Yeah, Dwight Howard. Fucking Dwayne Wade. And That's right. Yeah. This guy's painting his nails and so he's wearing a purple damn. <laughs> like, two Come on, man. Before he's GQ. Nasty. Game queer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so it's for GQ's J is getting queer. Yeah, right. <laughs> says, six, 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 six. what manner of man the ruler of the city is, such are all they that dwell therein. An unwise king destroyeth his people, mm -hmm. but through the prudence of them which are in authority, the city shall be inhabited. Hey, that's mm -hmm. why 
That's why kings had um, advisors, and the majority of advisors to kings were spiritual men mm -hmm. or righteous men, godly men, mm -hmm. right? These 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 kings of this, <laughs> their wise men are Chaldeans mm -hmm. or or um or or or, or, or witches or mm -hmm. wizards, warlocks, right? Okay, so with that, we're gonna close up. Give all praises and honor and glory to Yahweh. Sublimers to the apostles and bishops, elders of GMS, who rule well. Shalom to the elect. Shalom. And Kwame Sharala. Kwame Sharala. Abad Baba. Abad Baba.